All right, three, two, one, and we're live. Welcome once again to HeroQuest fans. And we have a special guest hero today with us. We have Sir Death. Can you hear Hi, me thank you for having me. Excellent. So this is a long time in the making. Uh, first we got Amalgamash, now we got Sir Death, who I mislabeled Sir David. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> That's so. okay. I don't know. I just I read somebody's name wrong, and then I just never get it right. But anyway, today we were going to do a quest here um, using the companion app, as long as it's working. Um, so you tell me if the screen ever goes away. Okay, at the moment I'm seeing it. Excellent. Okay, so we are doing the rescue of Sir Ragnar, and the only thing I forgot was I was going to play some royalty-free music. Hopefully this doesn't kill everything. But uh, yeah, thanks for joining us. Um, if you want to say a little bit about your channel, um, because you're much more famous than I am, you've been covering <laughs> quest like all throughout this remake. Tell us your your little story if you want. Just about my channel, or what I told you earlier about my experience with the game. Oh yeah, if you want to summarize kind of your experiences with Hero Quest. Okay, so first with my channel, I have a variety channel on YouTube. It's youtube.com slash SirDeathVids. I've been covering the Hero Quest remake ever since I knew about it because it was something that interested me. And I just kind of kept creating videos about it. And over time, people kept watching them. I'm the guy who's famous for having gameplay while most other people just either have talking head or they go on still pictures. And my experiences with Hero Quest, I got it at a yard sale originally in like 2010-ish. And it was just a regular board game for me. I'd played it with my brother a couple times. Mm -hmm. Eventually, my brother and I wanted to get into 40k. So we painted up the miniatures very horribly with some testers paints. Some time passed. I unfortunately made a dumb decision and threw out most of the board game pieces. A couple of years later, I decided to repaint those miniatures. That restarted my series, or it initially started my series of repainting old minis. That I began, I believe, 2018. And from that point, I was just slowly repainting them until I learned about the remake. And now we're here. Nice. Yeah. Yep. And um, I really enjoyed a lot of your videos. And yeah, I, I feel like there's a lot of people that do what you do in the sense that, yeah, just while you're narrating, you're playing a game. I'm just curious about that. Are you actually playing the game live or do you create the game footage just as background while you're talking? I just create it as background while I'm talking. So pretty much I just have this big library. Well, it's just not like a library, but just a bunch of random clips from when I've played games. Mm -hmm. And I mostly just focus on fantasy games. Sweet. And yeah, just put it in the background to provide some visual stimulus for... If the game, especially if the game ever goes to that younger audience, which hopefully it does, yeah, they are a little more impatient. And two, it's something for me, just a little bit extra so that I know that I'm producing good videos. Yeah, there's a whole art to it. Everybody's got their own style. Yeah. So we got L. Viler in the chat. Welcome. Um, we're not using your cool artwork this time just because I'm trying to do the, the app and it's kind of all over the screen, so... Um, but yeah, great supporter there, El Viler, and he did that really cool um, article on elviler.com about Stephen Baker and Doug Hopkins talking about their experiences. I was trying to get. Yeah, I still have to read that in detail, but oh, yeah, I had checked well, it out well, yesterday at work, and I thought it was pretty interesting. Yeah, I kind of want to ask those guys some stuff too, but I guess like there's a lot of topics they don't want to say stuff on, and it's kind of like, darn it, <laughs> like why can't we get more? <laughs> like I want to get the scoop. I want to. I want like. I want to hear like, you know, VH1 behind the music, you know, one night in a drunken brawl. They're like, no, the Chaos Warriors only move seven squares. And it's like, you know, break the bottle. And it's like, but I guess we just don't get to hear that kind of stuff. <laughs> but, that you know, you get what you can. I, I, I enjoyed it a lot. So, yeah. Well, no, I, I appreciate all the stuff. Um, and I think it's great that our little community, because we're really small, as you know, and we it's just been growing organically so i like the fact that i don't have to feel like oh it has to all be about me and like my ideas i mean i'm just helping people just inspire them a little bit so i think 
you inspire people and i think the fact that we have all these different like independent youtubers uh and bloggers vloggers whatever doing their own thing and the fact that we can come together and do collabs is really super awesome oh and there went the screen again um because it does feel like a community it's not just like uh like if, i'm just trying to think if there was like an official hero quest forum and it was run by the game designers and we were just guests there it wouldn't be the same like it would feel a lot more i don't know produced or something rather than just natural because i feel like we've been keeping yeah, the well, game places... alive for all this time yeah yeah i was about to say that places like yield and have kept the game alive for the past 30 years yeah we could do another 30 without them but the fact that they're working with us and trying to like connect with the community i mean they have to keep that professional distance still um but you know they're doing as much as they can so gen con's coming up and all that stuff hey just a real uh, quick question about fantasy games have you ever played a game well you ever played the lord of the rings video games i mean i know there's a lot of them i actually have not ah, okay well um two that i have i have i only have an xbox 360 i i haven't really got into the newer console games consoles but and i don't play as much steam as strange bus does but um there's a game let's see shadow of mordor i have that fun. one yes yeah and it's not bad on the 360 it's people give it a lot of bad bad press and everything say it oh it sucks and everything but the features that are missing really aren't that big a deal and I guess they've shut those down in the main uh, game anyway, like the interactivity between players. So it's all just single player now, but still a lot of fun. And I got it for cheap. And then the other one is War in the North, which I think is pretty fun uh, because it has the co-op. It has like the three three characters and you're going through like side quests that were like tangential to the movie. So you're exploring other areas of Middle Earth that weren't covered. Um, but it was totally overshadowed by Skyrim when it came out. So... Like nobody. Oh cared yeah, about I it. could see that happening. It's like, ah, eh, got it again. Got it for cheap. Fun game, and I'll listen to like the Peter Jackson soundtrack while I'm playing that, and it's pretty fun. Nice. And on the rant cast, the next rant cast with Strange Bus on Thursday, this Thursday even. Wow, it's coming up fast. We're gonna be talking about Lord of the Rings, Rings of Power. I don't know if you have any opinions on that, or if you want to say. I do kind of. Yeah, I've watched quite a few videos about it. Oh man, a lot of people however, are like, eh, I don't know, this may be a disaster. Yeah, however, despite all the b stuff that's wrong with it, I think it's still going to be successful. Could be. Just because, well, it is attached to such a big property, mm -hmm. and lots of people are just going to tune in for it being a fantasy show. Like, I know a lot I'm of people were fantasy. upset about The Witcher for messing up the lore, but I know it. that I didn't ever play the games or read the books, and I still thought it was pretty fun. That's pretty cool. nice experience welcome to solar 1927 yeah i don't know i guess we'll see what happens with it um i guess i don't have a lot invested and i've heard a lot of the like i've heard a lot of the people things people said like both producers of the show and fans that are nervous about it but like just watching the trailer it looks awesome but that's the problem with trailers like whenever i see a trailer i'm like oh man this this probably sucks because <laughs> like I'm just, they're just showing you the absolute best stuff and it's out of context and why don't we just hire the people to make trailers to make movies because it's always always lets you down not always but so often so i tried to just be like okay i'm just i'm just gonna not form any opinions right now so i don't know i guess i'll just kind of wait and see what people say because i guess i'm not as immersed in the lore of lord of the rings as some people like, I, I've never read The Silmarillion. Um, I have, I, actually. Ah, okay. Yeah. Well, it's, it's boring, as people say. In some parts, yeah. I did a whole video, actually, about if you should read it, if oh, you sure. want to watch that, too. I'll later. definitely have to check that out. Because yeah. there was one point where I was watching a lot of videos, and I thought, oh, I should just read it for myself. But I might have seen one of yours. I just don't remember. It's been so long. But yeah, it's just like... But I can understand that, okay, well, he didn't necessarily... He wasn't going to publish this in his life. He did well. He didn't in his lifetime. It was his son that did it and edited it together. And it was more just like him developing the lore. And then this is going to be almost like a fanfic based on a couple of lines from that, and not necessarily anything. So it's almost like they're not able to screw up the lore because they're not using it. But then it's like, how is this Lord of the Rings? 
It's like, okay, it's set in yeah, the exactly. Universe. It's one of it's yeah. one of those things, sort of like Netflix's Resident Evil, where they're basically just using the brand name to bring in the yeah. fans. It's such a weird, like, I mean, I, I I'm kind of in favor of the, and I'll talk about this more on the rant cast with Strange Bus. It's, I kind of like the idea of people just like stop remaking the same story. Like, it's better if you create a new story. Like, I hate it when they reboot a franchise and, like, let's just change, let's take all the themes that everybody thought weren't so important and just throw them to the wind. And just, yeah, it's like you have no respect for it. And that just pisses people off. And it's like, why would you do that? So it'd be better to just tell a new story. But the problem is you're still trying to draw in those fans by saying it's an official Lord of the Rings, you know, story and and all this. And it's like, oh, so what are you going to do? Are you just going to like embarrass yourself for a couple seasons and then do a bunch of fan service to draw people in? And it's not going to be enough and you wasted all your money and it goes down in flames and everyone's sad. Or are you going to carve out a little spot for yourself that will be good? And I guess the other thing that could happen, my little thought, is that, well, even if it's bad, you'll get all these disappointed people like kind of walking away. And then as they're walking away, like, some Lord of the Rings fans would be like, hey, wait, before you go, there's actually good stuff here. Let me show you, <laughs> you know, and then they can kind of <laughs> roll them back into the fandom with, you know, stuff that's actually good. Like that's I've been drawn into back into stuff like I was just so disappointed with the new Star Wars movies, but I watched the originals again and I'm like, this is a good time. <laughs> I think I'm just going to sit in this for a while and enjoy myself. Read some of the old, yeah. old comics and books that are "quote unquote" no longer canon. <laughs> sure. Yeah, I have Play the, the old original games. movies on VHS that I still need to be watching here again. I watched them many years ago. The Lord of the Rings movies. Uh, or, no, or Star Wars. Um, Star Wars, but I have also watched Lord of the Rings. I watched it, I think, last two years yeah. ago. Was yeah. the last time I watched them. Oh yeah. Well, it takes a while because they're pretty long. I. Yeah. I finally watched all the Hobbit movies, and I was like, uh, I guess I spent too much of my youth like watching the the cartoon version, and I just I just enjoy that so much that I didn't really need all that stuff. <laughs> well, but, another thing with the Hobbit too is that it went through basically development hell. Like Peter Jackson was brought on after Guillermo del Toro quit, I believe, oh, is what right. happened. I so yeah, he was that. super rushed. He was trying to write the story as he was filming it. Oh, shoot. Instead of having years to prepare, like with Lord of the Rings. Yeah, I think I heard that too, and I, I completely forgot about all that stuff. So it's not completely his fault, anyway. No. Like, how could you have just totally nailed it and then dropped the ball? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And it was I... also probably already set into three movies before he got there. Yeah. Like, it probably could have just been one, like, the single book. Exactly. Well, and some people have made fan edits where they've like compressed it down. I watched one of them and I thought it was all right. It wasn't too bad. I mean, it still had flaws in it, but it was easy to follow and yeah. Well, anyway, there'll be more to say about it as time goes on, but let's get into some hero quest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what it's, we're here for. So far, it hasn't crashed on us. So, That's good. All right, let's do the rescue of Sir Ragnar. So I'm just going to do my best to follow along with this. If you see something obvious that I'm missing, let me know. Because I'm so used to being Zargon and controlling everything. Um, I guess we'll just kind of follow along. But the music is muted, but you should be able to hear the sound. All right. So we've got Death Fans is our group here. Sir Ragnar, one of the king's most powerful knights, has been captured. You hearing that? There is reason to believe that he is being held prisoner by I have Ula, the stream the muted just warlock. so that I'm not hearing myself with the delay. You are to find oh, shoot, Sir yeah. Ragnar and well, bring him back to the stairway. You can see that text on Prince screen. Magnus offers a reward yep. of 240 gold coins to be divided among the heroes if they rescue Sir Ragnar. No reward is earned if Sir Ragnar is killed during the escape. 240 gold coin reward for rescuing him. If he's alive at the end. Yep. So you've never played this one, right? Correct. I have seen the quest book page, but I don't remember the exact layout. It's been a couple months since I've even looked at it. Yeah. Alright. So you are the barbarian. So I guess I'm still controlling it for everyone. Yep. 
So in a way, it's almost like I'm Zargon again. <laughs> okay. So, all right. So we're in the room. Where are you moving to? Oh, you got to roll your movement. Are you doing yeah, your own dice? I do, yes. Also, the screen just went black on me for whatever reason. Oh, shoot. Okay, let me see if I can get it back. Sorry, folks. Got it? Lost it. Oh, if I maximize it, that kills it. Okay, let me try this. Okay. Again. Blue stack. It was back for a second there. This is the blue stacks emulator. This is not the fault of the uh, app itself necessarily. You can see all these wonderful ads that they throw at you when you fire it up. See, it's just it crashes on purpose so it can show me more ads about other games. It's like, oh yeah, <laughs> I'll just play this Battle Night or whatever it is. June. Well, anyways, I had rolled a six on my movement dice, so five on one dice, one on the other. Okay. okay, so really I should just do as little as possible with the screen. I think we got it again. All right, you keep me keep me honest on this one. Okay. Sir Ragnar. Sir Ragnar. Okay. Okay, so you rolled what? A six? Yep. All right, where do you want to go? To the door? Yeah, may as well go to the door. Should we open the door? <laughs> 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 hmm. I'm assuming you want to open it, right? Yeah. Yeah, I should. Okay, so a goblin has been revealed. You got two more movement, but you've just got your broadsword, right? I do, yes. Just broadsword. I don't have a crossbow or anything. I should maybe get out of the way, though. Just Let use my two movement. All right. Get closer to the goblin. I know that it'll move closer to me, but that's fine. All right, so you want to go out into the, into the hall? Yep. Is there a big delay for you? There is, yes. Okay. You're just now selecting the barbarian to move in the two spaces. All right. Okay. We'll make do, though. All right. Okay, so you got the uh, the dwarf now. Gonna take any actions? I may as well... Do you know what? Let's search for treasure with him. Let's see what happens there. Get a big roll. Okay. Pull a card for the treasure deck. That's what he's going to say. Dwarf <laughs> searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. I will kill you, Batman. <laughs> All right. Okay, so I just drew a wandering monster. <laughs> oh, nice. Using my deck. I guess I just took the initiative there. I didn't know if you had your own deck there. Is that okay if I do the treasure? Yeah, definitely. All right. Yeah, my deck I don't think has shuffled well enough yet. All right, so it's an orc. Zargon's turn. <laughs> Misses. He missed. What a noob. Hero's turn. <laughs> okay, so that used up your action. You've still got movement. Okay, well, anyways, I had rolled right before you got me to search for treasure, and I got a nine there, so I could skedaddle out of the room. All right. Go towards the goblin, I suppose. Nine, you said? Yeah. Five and four. There we go. I tried to do it in one smooth movement. Okay, so my turn. I'm right. sure you two can deal with a single orc. <laughs> Let's see. All if right. not, I could rush back to help. Okay, so even though I'm controlling the bard, I'm just going to say he's a pirate. He's using a cutlass instead of a rapier. Same same old thing. Uh, let's move. And then we should be able to attack him. So it's going to tell me. Two, two, attack. Roll your dice.
roll the defend dice. Oh, so you're supposed to roll for them. Oh, and then you just subtract the body points. Oh, that's pretty easy. Okay. Get a little ASMR going. All right, one skull, and then he defends with two. And he got nothing, so he's dead. The orc has died. Yep. All right, the wizard. All right, he got six. Which two spell decks did you equip your wizard with? Oh, yeah. Uh, well, it'd be three. Or did you not do that already? Yeah, he's got fire, water, and earth. Oh, yeah, I guess it is three because the elf only gets one. Yeah, I sh really should get all the magic since he's not here. But I guess try to be somewhat fair because I don't think this quest is that tough, really. But we'll see. We'll see if I'm right about that. All right. Let's see. I should probably search for treasure. Wizard searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track oh. treasure on your character sheet. Potion of defense. So I'll add that. So that's plus two. Let's see, five, so one, two, three, four. Yeah. All right. Magnifico, the wizard. And Grognak, the pirate. All right, your turn, Sir Death. All right, I'll roll Barbarian's Movement. That is a six again, a four, and a two. Okay. I should be able to rush the goblin there. Another goblin is revealed. Okay. Yeah, it kicketh his buttoth. Yes, with my three dice. I'll roll those up. Oh, I did not roll a single skull. I got two normal shields, one Zargon shield. Oh, wow. All right. Whiff. Okay. Well, you're... And my dwarf can't even move past there. No. You could go you the other way. You could. Well, go ahead and roll for him, I guess. And... Okay. Oh, that's also a six, a five and a one. Hey, Jacer's here. Welcome. See, so yeah, I'll go d towards that down hallway. I'll maybe actually only go three tiles, and then I'll search for a trap. I actually haven't done that before, so we'll see how that works. Yeah. Always good to do that. Dwarf searches the area for traps. No, no tra traps discovered. No traps discovered. <laughs> cool <laughs> voice acting. I, I think I think the the mentor guy did a good job, and but whoever maybe it was the same guy who did Zargon is just so goofy. <laughs> but whatever. What you doing? Was that my action, Major Asnable? Yeah, that was your action. Okay. Yeah, that's Thanks. your turn. Uh, we're playing. Uh, um, we've got Sir Death vids or sir death here playing um the rescue of sir ragnar and we're using the app this is the first time i've played like a multiplayer game with it so zargon is completely automated and probably not doing as good a job as as i would but that's all right I'm trying it out j sir j actually if one of you guys wants to jump in i mean would you have any objection sir death oh i wouldn't we want to take control of one of these heroes. So we've got the Barbarian, a Dwarf, a Bard, which I'm calling a Pirate, and uh, a Wizard. 
yeah, it's not too bad. It's just like I keep wanting to jump in and do stuff, but it's like, oh, it does it for you. But then sometimes it, you have to do it yourself. Yeah, like, like rolling the dice you do yourself. Yeah, I guess rolling the dice is fun. So getting to do that makes a certain amount of sense. If I recall from one of the articles, they wanted to still keep it as the feeling of a board game. Mm -hmm. Even though in my experience when using the app, I kind of forgot to move the miniatures on the physical board and mostly just looked at the board on the app like what we're doing here yeah yeah that's true it kind of it takes on a life of its own it's hard to be both at once so it's almost like you're you're not being zargon like as an antagonist you're more as just like a facilitator you're still doing stuff but i guess it keeps the the surprise of the quest alive so yeah for sure because everything's covered by that fog of war yeah, I'm going to go ahead and just link the Discord. So if anybody does want to join us live uh, in this game, just go to Quest Talk, and you can take control of one of these heroes as we're playing. So Zargon's completely automated. So I've played this quest many times, but it's been a while. Okay, so we were up to... Okay, so the dwarf did his thing, so the pirate is next. Grognak the Legend. Okay, so he could search for treasure. Hey, hey, welcome. Bard, searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Oh, hello. Track treasure hello. on your character hey. sheet. Is that Jacer? Yes, it is. Welcome, sir. Yeah, this is kind of a spur of the moment thing. But uh... um, yeah, doing solo with the app. I forget to move pieces all the time, and then I play catch up, <laughs> readjusting the board. Doing the app with my daughter, we do move the pieces around a lot more. So I think there's a dynamic there, too, because if there's multiple people, you will move the pieces around. But doing a solo, you will forget. Yeah. Or you'll be moving on the app, or you'll move the guy, and then you'll be like, all right, and you're still working it, but then you're like, oh, I forgot to set up half a room. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can kind of cheat yourself, too, uh, by doing that. Um, okay, so I just found a treasure hoard, so I found 100 gold, so the pirate's got 100 gold. He's happy. Um, so, Jacer, which uh, hero or heroes would you like to take over? Uh, which ones are you guys using at the moment? Or which ones would you favor to use? Well, I guess uh, I my primary is the is the pirate. So I guess you could take my wizard if you want. Or Sir Death, would you volunteer your dwarf? Or would you I would. Yeah, I'd volunteer my dwarf. He's just the I'll standard the, dwarf. I'll do the dwarf. Okay. So Jacer, do you have your dice? Uh, hold on. Yes, I do. Somewhere. Yes, I do. Nice. Okay. And as far as house rules go, I'm trying to think if the, if the chat gets involved. Because this was not, you know, heavily advertised or anything. So we probably won't get many people. I mean, it's awesome that you showed up. Um, but I guess yeah, if people do happen to catch it up. If people do buy stuff, I can, I can toss in potions and things. Because it doesn't interfere with what we're doing in the app. It's going to be weird. <laughs> I guess we're just trying out different ways to play the game that we love. So different ways of doing it because i've got the potions deck here and i've got the i mean the zargon stuff could still happen it's just that if there's going to be a monster on screen you won't be able to see it i wonder if i could create a monster by well i guess it'd be a wandering monster like just have an extra treasure search and just like draw the wandering monster automatically <laughs> like oh there's an orc like i wish you could do more like you could actually put just place monsters of course I, then i guess it would be a full-blown quest creator app but who knows gen con's coming up anything could happen right so i guess if if you guys buy stuff with your channel points with your gold coins in the chat i'll just kind of have to wing it okay so the bard did his thing um i guess he can still move eight i don't think there's any reason to search for secret doors in that room so i'm just going to move into the hallway all right, so I'm still controlling the wizard, right? Magnifico. This will help me learn the game. I was just talking about this on Good Jesse Twitch stream about 10 minutes ago. Okay. 
Thanks, Major Asnable. All right. Whoops. What am I doing here? Why is he grayed out? Did I forget to do something here? Can't search for secret doors with the monster. Wizard searches for secret doors. Okay, no I broke secret doors found. I broke the rules. There's a monster there. Okay, never mind. Let's just uh Well, I guess maybe he should Somebody should explore that way too. Uh, we're looking for Sir Ragnar. Ah, I'll just have him go there. Alright, Zargon's turn. There we go. Sargon's turn. <laughs> yourself, barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Two hits, barbarian. Well, good thing you've got that helmet. Yeah, I have three defense dice. I rolled two shields Heroes and turn. one skull. All right, cha -ching. so I blocked it all. Nice. See, they don't have the little cha -ching when you block or anything. Oh well, it's a different way to do it. Okay, dwarf, Jacer, you're up. So your dwarf is in that corridor to the south, and you've just got your standard gear. So two attack, two defense, seven body, three mind, short sword. Uh, seven. Okay. Yes. Move. Let's move all the way to the south and uh, Let's pretend that didn't search for traps. Three, four, five. It's like as you go. Okay, well, there's a goblin there, so. I guess you. Well, I mean, you'd be searching the corridor we're in for traps, but I think we've already done that, so. See one, two, three, four, five. What'd you get for movement? Because that was five squares. Five. All right, then uh, seven next to the uh, goblin in attack. All right. Hopefully, there's no traps there. Don't open the door. Hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. Don't open the door. All right. Take him down. All right, and I missed. Wow. Now I have a short sword, right? Yep. Yeah, I missed. Man, you guys using the uh, official Hero Quest dice? <laughs> yes, I am. I'm using the old wooden dice. Oh, hey, well, nothing wrong with that. I was just thinking like the remake dice. And I'm using the remake dice here. I do have the wooden ones too, but may as well use the new ones. Yeah. Yeah, so it sounds like uh, Sir Death, you're you've got a, like a really like high end microphone, and uh, Jacer sounds like he's talking through a tin can, and I'm probably somewhere in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. This is, I, I think, like a phone, seventy dollar headset, so it's not the greatest mic ever, uh, but it works. Mine was like thirty, and Jacer, you probably got a phone, right? Yes, it's the mic on the phone. Yeah, yeah, it's all good. Yeah, so all at least we can all, if, as long as we can hear each other and understand. Okay, so the pirate, the orcish, orcish pirate. So he could run all the way around and attack these guys. I think that's just what he would do with his hundred gold in his pocket. Box cars I got twelve. Okay, one, two, three. See, I don't have to count it out because it shows me, but I still like to count it out. It's just what I do. Another goblin. It won't be quite enough to expose the wizard. Oh, man. It's not quite enough. All right, let him come to me. I guess that's oh, all. Oh, surrounded by goblins. Yep. All right, wizard Magnifico. Hmm. 
I've got so much magic, but just don't feel like it's necessary to use it all yet. I guess I could search for... Have we searched this corridor for secret doors yet? This double corridor to the south? I don't think so. I think you had searched Wizard one of the above ones. searches for secret Nothing. doors. No secret doors found. Zargon's turn. <laughs> Try to defend yourself. Dwarf. Right. Roll your defend dice. Dwarf one hit. What'd you, what, what'd you get, Jacer? Two shields. Okay, nice job. Okay. I blocked it. Nice job. All right, he's attacking me now. Try to defend yourself, bud. Roll your defend dice. Nothing. Okay, so I'm down to one less. Than I was. Try to defend yourself, barbarian. barbarian roll your defend dice. All right, I'll roll my three dice here. One shield, one skull, one zargon shield. So I blocked it. All right, and that last goblin is gonna come for me. Try to defend yourself, bard. Roll your defend dice. No defense. Three. Bummer. Hmm. Let's see where fate takes you. All right, barbarian. My movement this time. Oh, I guess I can't even move. Do you know what? I'll just attack the goblin right in front of me. Why not? Oh, you can attack and move. Stick and move. Whatever. Two skulls. Okay, well, let's just kill him. There's no way he can defend. Only the one defend us. Right. Has been defeated. All right. Where do you want to go? I'll maybe just move one square to the right there, and then I don't even have to roll the movement dice. Yeah, you got at least a one. I'm sure. Between two dice, yes. All right, Jacer. Try to attack again. And two skulls this time. Yeah, he's dead. The goblin has died. Alright, you moving anywhere? Uh, no, I'll stay there by the door for the next turn. Well, something went funny with the screen on my end here. Uh, yeah, Whoa. I was gonna say, I see lines. <laughs> Change the channel. We're back. Ah, this is the delay. Okay, I brought it back. Thanks, guys. Yeah, it was back there. Much back. Yeah, now it's back. Killed my friend Rodrigo. Well, you know what? We warned him that if he stayed with that crowd, he was gonna come to a bad end, so... That's what happens. All right. Okay. So <laughs> this is when you smack the side of the TV set. That's right. You get your uh, kid sibling to stand by the TV with play with the rabbit ears. And it's like, okay, perfect. And then they start to like walk away and then it gets, and it's like, no, no, go back. Hold on to it. <laughs> it's like, shoot, I can never sit down again. Watch the show. So you get some like tape and some uh, aluminum foil and try to like pin it in that perfect position. Yeah, smack the TV. Okay, I'm sorry, I lost my place here. So who's next? Okay, after it's it's my turn, right? Yes, the bard, the bard, the pirate, the orc pirate. Pirate. Yep. Yeah. So I just kind of renamed all this stuff. So he's got a cutlass instead of a rapier. And so his three spells, his three skills or whatever. So he's got the dart, uh, dart of sleeping venom. He's got yo-ho-ho -ho and a bottle of rum, which is his healing. 
And he's got a sharpened blades, which is his, you know, whatever, his other thing. Uh, okay, well, I guess they're both the same, so I'll just attack this, uh, this one above. Okay. Attack him with the cutlass. One skull. He rolls defense. One. He missed. He's dead. The goblin has been defeated. Okay. And I think I'm just gonna continue to block the uh, block the way. Magnifico. He's gonna come down and help split the party. All right, and he might as well just search for secret doors. I wonder if the game knows to do that corridor. Wizard searches for secret doors. No secret doors found. Let me just be sure that it actually did it. Wizard okay. searches for secret doors. No secret doors found. Cheat there, you guys didn't see that, okay. Zargon's turn. Zargon's turn. Try to defend yourself. Bard, roll your defend dice. Hey, why do you got to pick on the pirate? Just because I stole all your gold. Oh, two hits. Cha-ching. Blocked them both. Finally got nice. a good, decent roll. Grognak the legend. Right. The goblin. Misses! Ha ha, missed ya. Hero's turn. Alright. Sir Death. Well, because he missed, I'm going to kill him with my broadsword, hopefully. Yep. One skull. Alright. He missed, he's dead. He failed to defend. The goblin has been defeated. Moving anywhere? Yeah, I probably should move. Oh, that's a good roll. I got ten on the dice. Six and a four. All right. I should maybe move up at least three squares to unlock that hallway to see whether it's just a wall or whether it's actually a place to go. And there's another goblin, of course. See, I'm just not going to say anything because <laughs> I just need to shut my mouth. All right. And I'll use my, the rest of my movement to keep moving towards that door there. My remaining, what, seven? So I should be able to get straight up to the goblin. Still playing after I get the kids to bed. I might jump in and join you. Hey, thanks, Elviler. Okay, so you're going to attack him? I already used up my attack this turn. Oh, shoot. Yeah, you certainly did. No heroic brew for you. I don't know how to do the umlauts. Uh, oh. So we'll just do that. Blood. Okay. Chaser. Let's open that door. They okay, wait to reveal the monsters. Okay, so there's one orc in there. What's your movement? Eight. Alright. I guess, uh... Go to the south of the orc. And I'll uh, attack. And one skull. All right. Two defense. And he got nothing. He's dead. Oh, I have to physically kill him. Oh, yeah. The orc. Has been defeated. I just want to go for the kill button. Okay, nicely done, sir. All right, I'll fix this guy's wagon and 
come join you. One skull. He defends. Nothing. The goblin has been defeated. All right. Boxcars. All right, Magnifico, com coming up with you, Jacer. Entering the room, and I'm going to search for traps. Wizard, search is the area for traps. Okay. No traps discovered. Sargon's turn. Sargon's turn. Defend yourself. Barbarian, roll your defend dice. Barbarian, two hits. All right, so I should block, or try to at least. I rolled two shields and one Zargon shield. Hero's turn. All right, you're, you're up. Block. Oh, my turn again, yeah. All right. Just giving the screen a second to catch up. And now I'm going to swing for that goblin. I rolled zero skulls that time. Whiff. Gonna move or just stay? Well, let's see. If you move out of the way, one of us can move forward and try to get him. Yeah, I was thinking of doing that. Just move one square or to the left, and then you guys can come in there if you want. Oops. Keep wanting to click on OBS instead of blue stacks. It's so weird seeing the Hero Quest logo on the side like that. Okay. Uh, but first, Jacer. I don't think you've searched that room yet, have you? You just no. The guy? Let's uh, do it. Search for treasure. All right, jewels. You find a small wooden box. It is plain and old, but it can, but within it is lined with velvet. It contains fifty gold coins worth of jewels. Okay, so fifty gold coins for you. Right. All right. You gonna do any movement? I'll move one space up. Just block the door. Do you want to open the door? Uh, no. Okay. Just hold the door. All right, Magnifico. Hmm. So already search for traps. Let's see. I'm going to go in the corner here. This doesn't matter too much. Uh, let's search for treasure. Wizard searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track Heroic treasure on your character sheet. Heroic Brew. I'll probably give that to one of you guys. Heroic Brew, that's the two attacks. All right, Zargon. My forces strike in great number. <laughs> My forces strike in great number. Yeah, one. Defend oh, oh, yourself, barbarian. One. Roll your defend dice. One skull, barbarian. And I rolled one shield. Awesome. It's really nice having that Heroes helmet turn. because both my attack and defense are three, so I just roll the same three dice. You remember, you're like a fimmer. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. So Zargon's done, I guess. So back to you. Uh, I'll maybe just move one square to the left again, and then you can come in there still if you have enough movement. Wait, did you attack him? Oh. Oh yeah, I guess that was just my defense roll. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'll attack him. <laughs> you just kind of like, ahead of myself. You kind of flexed on him, and then you were like walking away, and he's like, "What?" <laughs> Three skulls. And they're dead. The goblin. Okay, and now I can actually died. move. The goblin has exploded. All right, so you're moving where? 
I'll roll the dice anyways. Well, one of them fell. Oh, that's a reroll. That, that is seven on the roll. Okay. Oh, you counted on the floor? Oh, man. That's old school. It's like the kids, like, peeking under the couch. You've got the flashlight, and you're like, I can see it. It's a skull. No. Well, anyways, I'll just move to the door. Either way, I had enough movement to move to the door there, and I'll open it. Brave. Well, I'm blocking the door anyways. Like, yeah, with your meaty pecs and yeah. iron head. Okay, so two arcs were revealed. All right, well, now we now we know what to do. So, Jacer, way back. Let me open. Side. Let me open the door. All right. Split the party. Two arcs. I don't know what you rolled for movement. Uh, I didn't roll yet. I was already at the door. Uh, but it's a six. Let's go. Edge. You know what? Just put uh, move me in just one space. All right. Because I was gonna say I can back you up from the other side. Does, you don't seem to have landed on any traps, so so far so good. All right, all right, good. Uh, it, let me attack the one by the table. All right, go for it. And one skull. No defense. All right. The orc. And your wizard has, has a staff. Died. No, I've just got a dagger. Just a dagger. Okay. Yeah, we didn't we didn't inherit any gear from the last quest. We just kind of started fresh. Except, Sir Death did have uh, some of his guys had some stuff, so he was just able to get a helmet. Otherwise, everything's default. Okay. But I do have um, a potion I could give you. Of course. I mean, why would you waste heroic brew on just one orc? Um, you have a fire of wrath. <laughs> I do. I mean, I get, I could throw a dagger at him from here. So I think it's the Bard's turn next, anyway. Just kidding, guys. Right? Yeah. Or the pirate. Yeah, the pirate. I I uh, just jumped the gun there. So I put him back. Okay. So I should I should help the barbarian. They were splitting the party. Why am I doing this? Should talk to you guys out of it. All right. Twelve. We're just a bunch of brash eager uh, adventurers. That's what it is. I've been getting 12s a lot. I think it's pretty lucky. Yeah, I was going to say that pirate moves. Yeah. 10. Let's see. Let me just check his uh, his abilities here. There's Follow one thing you can get back. Instructions. Yeah. One extra combat die. Regain it when you see them roll two white shields. Of course, that would be my action to do that. Um, okay, I'll uh, I'll use it on the barbarian. So I'll use my sharpened blades on you, so you'll get to attack with one extra. And I think it just lasts for one turn. I've like never used this character before. Follow the spell card's instructions. Next time. Next time. Okay. All right. So that's what he did. And Magnifico. Now he's going to go forward. And he's going to throw his dagger at that uh, at that orc there. Missed, and he lost the dagger. Okay, that was silly. All right. Zargon. By the way, if you guys are using anything, well, I guess you don't have any potions to use, but yeah, since that just happens in between, you can always just yell it out. Zargon's turn. 
Defend yourself, Ooh, dwarf. Dang. Roll your defend dice. Three hits, Jacer. And I blocked one. So two. So you're down to five. Well, I can always heal you. Only one orc can attack. Defend yourself, barbarian. Roll your defend dice. All right, three hits, barbarian. Ooh. I only rolled two shields that time. All right, so you are down to seven. Seven. First blood. Does that mean that guy gets his skill back? Oh, you, did you roll two? Two shields, yes. Ah, thank you, Jason, for reminding me. Okay, sharpen blades again. Yeah, it's going to be weird, like, keep getting it back. I guess it's not that powerful, so it's like you just keep getting it back, getting it back. Okay. Hero's turn. All right, Barbarian, so you've got three, uh, three attack, or four attack dice. Yeah, I'm just going to go for the orc straight in front of me. That is only two skulls. Right, let's see what he gets. Ching! And then he was killed by the other one. So he just got one black, she black shield. The orc has been defeated! Alright. You want to use any movement? or I mean, I think you're Yeah, I got five there. on my dice. So I'm maybe just going to move into the room enough for you to go in there. Well, I mean, I can pass through you, is the thing. So, do you still want to go in? Uh, it's up to you. Whatever okay. you think is optimal. I say, I say stay where you're at. Okay, then I'll just stand my ground. I just want you to take all the damage. I mean... <laughs> Oh, I looted his body when he died. That's what he would have wanted. Okay. Chaser. Alright, let me swing at that orc. And two skulls. See, since I'm still, like, rolling for the monsters, I feel like I'm still kind of Dargon. Two skulls, you say? Yes. And he's dead. Alright. The orc has died he doesn't seem sound at all broken up about that either the orc has died <laughs> yeah and the undead never die they're they've been defeated yep the skeleton is still dead All right, Jacer. What's your move? Uh, I'll stay there. No, no, nothing's real. Uh, you know what? Let's move one space towards the table. All right, and dive into that trap then. Okay, I understand. Oh, I guess there wasn't one there. Never mind. Nothing. All right, pirate. I think I'm going to uh, sharpen your blades again, Barbarian. So you'll roll one attack, and I'm good with that. Magnifico is going to go into the room, since I know it's safe, and go ahead and search for traps. Wizard! Search as the area for traps. No traps, no traps discovered. Zargon. Zargon's turn. Oh. Misses. Ah, uh -huh, the orc, orc missed. He got three white shields. Well, I guess that's my sharpened blades again, because he got three white shields. <laughs> I, I they probably yeah. intended to mean a hero when a hero gets it. My dread magic should overcome all. Always look for the loopholes. I'm just gonna look at my thing real quick, to see if they if they thought of that. When any hero Follow you can see excluding yourself rolls two de rolls no. defense dice that result in two white shields. He was an orcish, only heroes. orcish hero. No, he wasn't. Okay, you're you're up. All right. 
I will attack this guy with four dice this time. Because you sharpened my sword. Yep. Oh, only one skull out of all of that. Still. No defense, he's dead. <laughs> the orc has died. Alright. And you... I'll move into the room. I have four movement. I can just move those four squares bases. Alright, which direction? Probably in an L shape. Three up and one left. Alright. So we know there's no traps there. Chaser. We search for secret doors. Or. Traps. We search uh, for traps. Traps. Uh, I'll do a uh, treasure then. Alright. I don't even have to click the thing. Just. Uh... Oh, wait. No, I do have to click it because if there is a quest treasure, then the app would have to know what it is. Right, and it keeps track of each the hero, hero so you treasure. don't end up uh, searching twice by Black accident. Treasure on yeah. your character sheet. Yeah, because you could just keep drawing cards all day. It would never know. You'd just be cheating yourself. Okay, so you just got a potion of speed. Okay. So that's twice as much dice if, if you use it. I'll, uh, I'll trade the wizard of speed for the uh, heroic brew. Okay, so you're giving me the speed. Thank you. You're welcome. It sounded like someone just uncorked something just a moment ago. Do we have like a live sound effect there? No, that was actually just me drinking water. Yeah. It's like, here, I'll give you this potion. <laughs> <sighs> and you hear the cork going back in. It's like, what? <laughs> it's real! It's real! It's not a game anymore, guys. It's actually a real fantasy adventure. It's not fantasy, it's fact. Okay. <laughs> you know, you've been playing too long, or it's gotten too hot in here, or something. Something's happened. Alright, thank you for that. Okay. Um, the Bard, aka the Pirate Cleric Work Guy thing man all right going into the room okay so we've searched for treasure only in here or no you, uh, you just killed the guy and went that in room the room search at all search it for anything yeah i did not My search it at all searches the okay. area for traps no traps discovered okay just to be on the safe side all right magnifico all right i'm giving you the heroic brew here you go Thank you. Okay. And we've searched for... Okay, search for secret doors. Wizard searches for secret doors. Secret, secret door, door discovered. Hmm. Zargon's turn is next. I'm just gonna. Yeah, I'm just gonna stay put. Alright, Zargon's turn. Play Zargon's bird. turn! Hero's turn! Alright, back to Barbarian. I might search for treasure in this room. Alright. How certain are you? 100% certain. Okay. I may as well. Alright. Gamble, my friend. Barbarian searches the area for treasure. Draw right. a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. Oh yeah, I haven't cast uh, sharpened blades on you, so I gotta earn it back. Jewels. You find a small wooden box. It is simple looking and very old. Within you discover that it is lined with velvet and contains very small jewels worth fifty gold coins. Nice. Up to 59 for me. 59, dude. Alright. Alright, anything else? Should I maybe wait until your sharpened blades is back before rushing into the next room? Mm hmm. 
I'm still just going to move there. I'm not going to open the door, though. I rolled a 10 on the dice, but I could literally just move two with the minimum amount. All right, geez. you want to move to the door? Yeah, just two. Oops. <laughs> you can see I just, like, clicked the wrong thing. I should grab a potion for myself to drink here for a second. Open the door. Not yet. All right. in the quest. Snow Dasher, you're back! Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, he is, he is quarter of Oswald. Uh, gotta count for some. Okay, so, Chaser. Uh, it's, uh, I got five. I guess let's open the door. Domination in an orc. You've got the heroic brew. Now might be the time. Yeah. Uh, I, take a sip and take a step. Oh, you were drinking it, not me. Sorry. Okay. Uh, attack the orc first. One, one skull. Nothing. All right. And the orc. Two skulls for died. the femur. Two skulls for the femur. Yep. He's got three defense. Two body points. No defense. Two skulls, you say? Yes. The abomination has died. That's right. Ha! <laughs> Got him! Couldn't resist. All right. Nicely done, sir. Nicely done. So, heroic brew was put to good use. Yes, it was. That was a heroic effort. Okay. Bard. All right, I'm going to search. See, I, it's like I always revert to the original name. So, pirate orc. Okay. Search over treasure. Name calling now. Abomination is a harsh, harsh word, it be. I. That it be. Bard searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. Potion of healing. Okay, enveloped in a bundle of rags, you find a small bottle of liquid. You recognize it as a healing potion. You may drink the potion at any time. It will restore up to four lost body points. Good. Plus four heal. Some movement going. Four. All right. Magnifico. Okay, so we've searched this room for everything, I think. And you just cleared out. Whoops. You just cleared out the uh, northern room. So I've got seven. All right, um, search that room for treasure. Mm. 
wizard searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. Gold. You search and find small amounts of gold hidden in several places, but lose track of time. Roll one die and multiply the result by ten to see how many coins you find. Miss your next turn. Dang it. Six. Okay, so I just found 60 gold, but I miss a turn. Is that one of your custom cards? Yeah. Cool. Yep, copied from the European deck. Basically, I just copied all the unique ones in there because I felt like they were missing. Yep. Okay. Sargon. My goal is to destroy you, heroes. Heroes turn. All right. Back to you, barbarian. I will kick down that door, first of all. All right. Kick down the door. All right. The door was kicked down. Just waiting for the screen to catch up here so I can see what's going on. Two goblins and an orc. And a treasure chest in the room. Okay, the furniture just loaded. And, oh, okay, now the monsters did. Ah, like I seconds. will move over. Oh, yeah, I guess I have to roll first. Or do you think I should just stand my ground at the door and block? Yeah, I'd say so, because I've got a, I got a, got a diagonal weapon I can cover you. All right, so yeah, I'll just stand my ground and let you guys do your turns. All right. Okay, sir. I will. Uh, I'll search for treasure as well. All right. We know it's going to be a card, so. Hazard, while searching, you are searching a hidden arrow, shoots from the wall and strikes you, you lose one body point, and your turn is over. Alright, well. Four. <coughs> Not the potion I was looking for. Nope. Potion of arrow. <laughs> okay, bonus monster for Zargon. Okay, so I think how this is going to work is... The wizard doesn't have a turn, but I could get a wandering monster. Like, just on purpose. So I'll do that. Uh, it would have to be a hero that hasn't searched for treasure. Oh, because it counts. Ah, oh, shoot. Unless you stepped into the other room, a room that you didn't search. Yeah, what a shame to use that up. Yeah, because if I go into this room, it's going to say I've already searched it. Interesting challenge. It's a second search for treasure. Wizard searches the area for treasure. Draw if it's treasure still card. my turn, I can do it. Character sheet. Okay, yeah. I guess you could do it that way too. Defend I was just going to say you could walk me one wizard. step into that room, Roll search for treasure. Oh wait, I guess you can't when there's monsters present. Never mind. Yeah, yeah. It, it's weird. I don't know. We're just we're just figuring this out on the fly. Okay, so we got one <laughs> goal. Oh. Wizard took a took a hit. It's down to three. Hero's turn. But I'm just gonna pretend that he was still in the room here. So we get the bonus monster. Okay. Nice. All right. So it's actually the. Okay. Did I just goof this up? Okay. So the barbarian, you were gonna stand your ground. We did Jacer. I skipped, and then. So it's the bard, the pirate. Ah, I got it. I'm gonna get it right one of these times. Okay, so I'm gonna just go ahead and once again sharpen blades for the barbarian. Cause it's been working really well. Or no, I don't have it. I don't have it. Shoot, I might actually have to go in and fight if I want some action. All right. Well, I've got plenty of uh, plenty of healing. Six. Next challenge, have enough channel points to do the 300 more times. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay. Yeah, because I can just move in and attack the orc. Okay. 
one skull. He defends. No defense. He's dead. Killed the the orc has died. It's like, die, fellow orc. <clears throat> Alright, Zargon's turn. Zargon's turn! Alright, he's attacking you. Self dwarf. Roll your defend dice. Alright, I got Chaser. one shield. Okay. So you're down to two. Hmm. <laughs> the goblin misses. Goblin missed. Defend yourself, bard. Roll your defend dice. Ching. Blocked it. Hero's turn. Alright. Barbarian. You're back. Can I move past you or no? Yeah, heroes can always pass through each other. Just like monsters can pass Okay, well, I have to roll my movement first, but we'll see. Oh, yeah, six in total is enough to get around. Right. And I'm just going to move, well, really three spaces, I believe, just to get to that uppermost goblin. All right. And I will attack him. Two skulls. The goblin has died. All right, Jacer. Let me attack him. So, Elbiler, if you're back, and two skulls. If you want to jump in, you can. Or I don't know if you're actually back for real, though. Two skulls, you say? Yes. Ching, and then he's dead. Locked one and was killed by the other. The orc has been defeated. Got him. Got him. All right, pirate. He's gonna unleash. Uh, can I just move in front of that door? Two spaces. Oh, sorry, forgot to do that. Yep. There you go, sir. Do you want to open the door? No. Sorry about that. I'm a little, I'm a little low. I'd rather uh, let the door defend. Yeah. <laughs> oh, totally whiffed. Darn it. I'm gonna try a little experiment. Just lurking. Not sure if I'll have time to get in. You guys are getting through pretty quick. Eh. Hey, it's it's all good, man. If you wanna jump in for a little bit. It's, your call. Okay. Magnifico. Alright, so we've searched for treasure already. There's probably no point in searching for secret doors or traps. I've stepped on three of the spaces and you stepped on the other one. It looks like I have to go into the room. Let's just go into the room. Okay, how do I... Uh, click the dwarf and then the door. It's, it's a little funny oh. about other people opening the doors. Allow me! <laughs> the chivalry is dead. Sir Ragnar has been found. Well, I was like, okay... If he's not in here, I'm not sure where he is. Okay, so we've got Sir Ragnar. I'll just go ahead and order my Mythic tier so that I can get a copy of that miniature. Should be here in a couple of weeks. Too bad I had to pay 600 bucks for it. Oh well. The Jacer J controls Sir Ragnar. Sir Ragnar is wounded and has two body points left, dudes. He may roll only one red die for movement each turn. He may not attack, but may roll two bodacious defend dice. You must find your way to the He's spiral the same stairway life total as I to do. reach safety <laughs> and continue on your quests. All right. Hey, they actually.
actually play the orc horns from uh, Lord of the Rings. Uh -huh. Plates revealed pieces. Okay, so everything is real. Well, at least there's some monsters left. Normally when I play this quest, we kill everything. And it's like, man, he's got to be in one of these rooms. And oh, and then we find him and it's like really uneventful. <laughs> so at least <laughs> we have something to do. Okay, some loot. Yeah, now the alarm actually has stakes. Yeah. Yeah, and see, when I've done this quest, I've, like, put secret rooms that trigger and, like, big groups of orcs, like, burst forth. Because it's like, okay, otherwise it's going to be really boring. It's a lot of rolling and not a lot happening. Okay, so I had you open the door. And I guess I could go in there and search for treasure. <laughs> Just to try to get even more loot. You cannot search this room. What? That's silly. Wizard searches for secret doors. No what? secret doors found. Why did I do that? That was silly. I wasted an opportunity to use some magic. All right. But I do have a potion defense. Um, what do you think? Do you think they'll try to kill Sir Ragnar? I mean, I could give it to you, uh, Jay, sir. I'll get. I'll, that's what I'll do. I'll give you the potion of defense, and you can decide what to do with it. What? Uh, what? Well, what? Um, what spell groups did you take? Okay, so I've got fire, water, and earth. So I've got two healing. Do you have rock skin still? Yeah, I haven't used any magic yet. All right. Well, then give him the defense potion and put rock skin on me, or heal me, or whatever on your next turn. Okay. So at least, at least that's, you know, should help me just as much as the potion. Doesn't say he can't use potions. So, all right. So I give Sir Ragnar the potion of defense. <clears throat> all right. Zargon's turn. Let's do this. Zargon's turn. Yeah, Alviler, you're right. We are getting close to the end here. We found him, like, really fast. And I wasn't, like, relying on my memory. I was, like, pretending I didn't remember. <laughs> well, of course, to be fair, though, when I have played it, I have, like, rearranged it. So I guess I don't have it that memorized. Okay. The Goblin misses. Missed. Looks like I have to defend here. Maybe. No, he missed. He missed. Oh. Roll two white shields. The Goblin misses. Missed again. Keep missing the target. Okay, we've got a lot of monsters now. All right. Let's see. You are down to seven. You've barely taken any damage. I've taken some damage. Yeah, I'd be fine to continue blocking the door and just keep swinging on them. Yeah. Hmm, I could go for that. If you goblin. maybe want to deal with the, yeah the one that's in the room with us. Because otherwise I could try to heal you. You cannot hope to defeat me! Alright. Okay, so your turn first. Alright, well, I'll just attack the thing right in front of me. Don't even have to worry about movement. One skull. All right. Nothing. He's dead. Uh, the, the goblin in the room or the goblin at the door? I should maybe do goblin in the our room. Okay. And then you can still attack the that goblin anyway, right? Has yep. died. All right. Jacer. First mission. I got I got 5. Hey, welcome new person. Anner can dominate. Yep. First, with the app. Second quest overall. Yeah. Yeah, Sir Death uh, is taking his historic run through the original quest. Hey, Strange Bus, welcome. Welcome. Well, this is, this is wonderful. Hey, you know, maybe we could do another quest after this one. If... 
people want to. <laughs> I don't know what everybody's schedule's like. I mean, this was just kind of off the cuff. Okay, I'm sorry, Jay, sir. You were... Um... I got five. Okay. So, yeah. uh, stick me in front of that other door. Okay. Ah, keep trying to, like, click on the wrong thing. Okay, you want to go down here? Yeah, over one and down four. Okay, did I move you too much? I moved you five squares. Yeah, that's it, five. Oh. And Sir Ragnar... It's one die. Got a four. Okay. Anyone else plays this as a kid when it first came out? Yep. I got two of the big collector's editions on the re-release, too. Laughing out loud. Yeah. Well, as long as you didn't scalp it, and if you did, please don't tell us that you did. I have two versions of the game, too, actually. I have my Mythic tier, and then I have that retail copy straight from Hasbro. Okay, so we did Ragnar, and now it's the pirate's turn. Yeah, we had a lot of trouble getting blue stacks working, but once it started, it just didn't stop. Okay. These darn goblins. Alright, I'm just going to attack the goblin here. With my pirate cutlass. It's not a rapier. Okay, two skulls, he's dead. The goblin has died. So strange bus, the only thing wrong is the voice acting. <laughs> it's very wrong. I mean, it's funny at first, but just, uh... what I'd like to do is just like hack into it and like replace the voice files with my own voice acting. Awesome. I played when I was a kid. Only have my new set though. Gave away my original when I went to college. That's the one. That's the thing I regret most of my life. Well, just look that guy up on Yielden and be like, listen. Listen here, mate. Come on over and I'll buy it off you. Yeah. And he's like, oh. He caught me at a good time. <laughs> I'm, I've, I've hit hard times, and uh, but it can be had for the low, low price of, quote, large price here. Probably still better deal than eBay. My original is tucked under my dresser right now. Ha ha. Yeah, good stories, guys. Thanks for joining us on HeroQuest Fans. Oh, we've got uh, quite a few people. We've got Quinfgogticlons. He might be real and might be a bot. We don't know. Somebody look him up. <laughs> okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, back to what we were doing. Uh, so, after the bard, aka the pirate, we've got the wizard, Magnifico. And he's going to roll for movement. Eight. Alright, Zargon's turn. Zargon's turn! Defend yourself, barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Sir Death, three skulls. Ooh. Let's see if my helmet can block any of these. Two shields and one skull. Ching. Oh, I just got my... So you get your... Yeah. Okay, so you took one damage. You're down to six. Yep, down to six. But I've got my sharpened blades back. Excellent. Yeah, Sir Death Vids, everybody. Check him out on YouTube. Do you have Twitch as well, or just YouTube? Just YouTube. Yeah. 
but you've got an awesome channel and a lot of cool cool stuff on there. Thank you. Yeah, I'm a little bit slow to the news though. Like I, I'm working on a video about the stuff that you talked about all yesterday. Ah, yeah. Well, see, guys like me, we got to get in there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You can take your time a little bit, and it's like, all right. I know he's going to talk yeah, about I guess it. I have, the, <laughs> I have the search thing down pretty good that I'm usually able to get a couple hundred views even if I'm late. That's good. That's good. Yeah. I'm still learning the game. So, hey, get what you can get and let's go from there. Yeah. Hero's turn. All right. And speaking of the game, here you are. I'm going to swing for the orc in front of me then. Swing for the fences. One skull. Ching, he blocked it. Okay. Jacer. Jacer the dwarf. Alright. Uh, I got eight. Eight. Uh, I guess attack the goblin. Perfect. And one skull, one black shield. Oh, he got oh. nothing. The goblin. Good, has good. Died. And Sir Ragnar got a three. All right. And the pirate, whose name is Grognak. The legend. All right. So at this point, the, the legendary singing pirate. <laughs> yep. <laughs> the same. Okay. Eh, he might as well just attack. At this point, attack that orc. Two skulls. What's he gonna do? Nothing. Nothing. The orc has been defeated. See, they need to add more layers of detail to this. I mean, Zargon should like have like a tally, like when his monsters are getting low. It's like you are defeating my monsters. You know, you could be saying something like, <laughs> "I can get more. <laughs> I'll get more, and I'll come back." Oh yeah, so kind of like how the bots in Age of Whoa! Mythology have voice lines, or it's oh. like not voice lines, but they say it in chat. Yeah. I don't know if you've ever played that game or not, but it's pretty fun. I haven't, but the concept is familiar to me. Yeah, some kind of interactive, yeah, stuff. So thank you for it's an RTS game, yeah. Dominate. It's followed us, so we got the uh, the Ric Flair. Woo! Woo! There's like young Ric Flair and there's like older Ric Flair. <laughs> Either way, <laughs> Rick, call us. All right, and Magnifico. Nine. All right. So we were going to use some magic. Um, you want... Uh, so you're down to two body points, Jacer. Yeah. I'll just heal you. How about that? Okay. All right. So you've got six now. I just used my uh, water peeling. Oh, I can be all I can be all fancy and get the spell out. So I'm so used to doing all this myself. Just follow the spell card's follow instructions. The card's instructions. Okay. Well, just imagine there's like shimmery blue stuff going towards your character, and then all of a sudden he's got like body points back. Because the thing is, you can actually like go onto a sheet and you can like like subtract them here but we haven't been doing that and really don't have to okay taking off catch you again sometime well thanks for stopping by Anner can dominate glad to have you on board Woo! all right Zargon my goal is to destroy you heroes <laughs> 
yourself. Barbarian. Two Roll skulls. your defend dice. Two skulls. Sir Death. And two shields as well. Ching. Oh, sharpened blades. Well, I already had it, but yeah. Still, still have it. Still got it. <laughs> Foolish adventurers. Your the helmet is very is handy. Sealed. Otherwise, I would have maybe just had one shield and one skull. All right. All right. Yeah, that's Jake. very true. If that that bard follows down or follows around someone that's got a lot of uh, defense dice, he'll be getting it back I and mean, using it almost every turn. Booster. Yep. Okay, Jaster, the mighty. I got nine. All right. Which way are you going? Need I ask? Okay, so what's our strategy, guys? Are we going to try to drain the quest of all uh, vitality, or are we just going to head for the door and call it a day? I mean, we could send Sir Ragnar out and just like, keep hanging out. <laughs> uh, I want to head towards that uh, the treasure chest room. Okay. But uh, I don't want to leave them vulnerable in case the monsters come out the other door. So I just want to move up next to the the wizard, or or even a space or two above him, like so. Yeah, like right in that the circle, the square, squared circle. Yeah, squared circle. And uh, Mr. Ragnar got four. All right, as he does. He's in shock. Before there was such a rule. Yeah, all this voice acting is why the app file size is so large. Correct. Correct. And that's why I take that's why they can't just like release everything. Of course I guess, you know, they could just release it with just like subtitles or something and then add the voice acting later. But they probably just don't want to do it that way. Alright. Rocknack, the legend. Hmm. I'm going to give you sharpened blades, Barbarian. Trying to make sure that one orc is dead? <laughs> yep. All right. Magnifico. Six. All right. Do you need any other magic, uh, Jacer? I don't think so. Because you were saying earlier that you wanted the uh, I, rock skin. The rock skin, just in case. Okay. But then the orcs went and funneled towards the other way. None of them came out to go to that door to try to block the stairwell. So. Well. I'll give that, you. I mean, that, that's just the way the AI is. But I don't know if we get closer to the stairs, if they were going to start coming the other way or not. Yeah. Especially oh. since only one can attack the Barbarian. Well, he's got the potion, so yeah, you're right. They could go either way. I'll give you the rock skin, though. Unless you think I should just give it to myself. I could do that. Cause, I don't know. There's there's so many things I could do. I've got so much magic. I just don't know what to do with it all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, give it to yourself. Okay. Rock skin. So now I've got three until I lose a body point. Which hopefully I won't. Okay, so I only moved two. Uh, yeah, they might come either way. Let's see. Yeah, it would take him quite a few turns. I think I'm... Well, yeah, I should probably stay there and block the way for Ragnar. Zargon's turn! Defend <laughs> yourself! Barbarian! Roll your defend dice! Two hits, Sir Death. Alright, I will defend. 
Two Heroes shields turn. again. Ching. All right, sharpened blades is back. Okay. That was it. That's all they're gonna do. <laughs> Weak. Yeah, that's what I'm. It's the AI, but that's what I said. Like, if you had five monsters, you would have split them up. Yeah. Play Sargon. You know what I mean. Villainous, yeah. villainous feet. Get those. Uh, get those. Uh, chaos cards going. Um, yeah, just murder the heroes. Make sure they don't come back again. Cause you got uh, you got other stuff to do besides playing Hero Quest. I mean, come on. All right. <clears throat> Time to attack them. Yep. And I have sharpened blades on. Correct. Well, let's see. Wait a minute. Yes, I did. I gave it to you. Yep. If I didn't, <laughs> I'm a moron. Two skulls there. All right. Ching, but he was killed by the other. The orc has died. Ah, chaos card. All right. All right, where are my chaos cards? Now this will be again be the creativity trying to figure out how to get it uh, to work with the. Uh, I guess it depends on what it is. Yeah, I suppose you could just subtract the body point for me if it's one of those spells or like skip my turn if it's the one that does that mm -hmm. let's take one wounded frenzy alright I think I know how to use it which is weird because it's like I'm working against myself because I'm a hero <laughs> <laughs> okay uh Thank you, Elviler. Okay, so it's your turn. You killed the guy. Okay, sir. You're a squeaky toy. Yes. He wants Man. to hold on. It's like put that put that orc out of his misery. Like <laughs> we thought we got him. He's like on the ground squeaking. It's like ah. <laughs> All right, Jay, sir. He's attending to the pooch. All right, oh, I got <laughs> interactive <laughs> yeah. dog. It's like uh, buy buy a treat for the dog. Oops. All right, I got four. Uh. Strange bus in here. I'm gonna have to message Strange bus real quick because he was thinking we might be done by eight. I'll let him know we're still playing. Okay, so you got eight. I got four. Sir Ragnar got six. Oh. I guess move uh, the dwarf over uh, three, just to hold that door, and Sir Ragnar, six. Okay, so now he's in the corner of that square. You, you just wanted to go those four squares? Okay, as long as I uh, heard you right there. So you guys wait for it to catch up. Yeah, I guess it's hard for me to follow because I have blue stacks and then I have OBS and then I have Twitch. <laughs> it's like three different screens. I just close Twitch. It's like, all right, I don't want to be too confused. Okay. Pirate. All right. Hmm, I could either attack him with two or I could have you attack him with four, but he's going to have a turn, so I should probably just go in there and finish him off. All right, I'm going to attack the orc. My cutlass. Taste of my cold steel. Got one skull. 
He rolls defense, and he gets nothing. The orc. Does that chaos Has spell even apply defeated. here, or is it not until one of us gets wounded? Uh, I just gotta decide when to use it. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Was that the last monster? Oh, shoot. That was the last monster. <laughs> okay, so let's just pretend that I didn't do that. Bard searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. <laughs> Defend yourself, Bard. Roll your defend dice. But what I should have done... Okay, so uh, Wounded Frenzy. Uh, hero's attack merely angered a monster by wounding it. Any one monster under hero's attack suffers no damage and may immediately counterattack. So this works perfectly. During nice. the hero's current turn with two extra combat dice. So we got three. Wait, so you have to roll two yeah, more. I have to roll. Wow. You might kill me. <laughs> Two more skulls. Wow, so he just got five skulls. Oof. Let's see if I'm, if I'm dead. I'm dead. We're but, using the Hero Quest companion app to play this. But I just... My healing kicks in. Boom, I'm back to four. Ugh. I'm alive, mateys. Prepare to meet the unknown! Prepare to meet the unknown? Good thing he had that healing rum. <laughs> yep. And his, and his hollow peg leg. Just for such an occasion. Alright. Magnifico. Boxcars. Let's see. Can't quite get in range. Well, not quite within sight. I mean, there's only one left. And yeah, it might as well. Alright. Um, it's Argon. Zargon's turn. Oh. Defend hey, yourself, barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Okay, so two skulls for uh, Sir Death. Yeah, welcome. All right, I'll roll, up, I'll roll up my defense. Oh, I did not roll any shields that time. Ooh, so two hits. Down to four. Mm-hmm. But I get to attack him back. Yep. And I only have Heroes three turn. this time, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Two skulls. No defense. The orc has been defeated. Decided to return the favor to him. Got him! Got him! Nice. Okay. Jacer. Alright. I. We're just Ten. sweeping up. Alright. Going towards the treasure? Yeah, let me go to the treasure room. Okay, what's the shortest route here? No, the other treasure room. Uh, the one that opened up next to this, uh, all the way to the left. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. What was your roll again? Ten. Oh. Okay. How about Ragnar? Two. If I Kareth was here, he'd say, see, this is proof that he's a traitor. <laughs> it's like, you don't know that. <clears throat> All right, Grognak, the legend. 
It's gonna search for treasure. Oh, I've already searched for treasure. Okay, fine. Secret doors, I guess. Bod searches for secret doors. Well, what am I saying? Every secret door. Everything's found. been revealed, so there shouldn't, <laughs> there shouldn't actually be any. Well, no, wait a minute. Does it reveal secrets though? I guess all rooms are open and all doors are open, so it have to. So all that's left is treasure, and well, potentially traps, I guess. Okay, whatever. <laughs> It's like we assume that they're following the rules here. Find some bugs. Got a bug and carming about it. Nine. All right. So, whoops. Hey, right back there. Searching for treasure. Whoops. Let's make sure I click on the right wizard. Thing. Searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track Ooh, treasure on your character sheet. Spikes. <clears throat> Down to two. Zargon's turn. Is that the second Hero's time that happened turn. to the wizard? Did he got a hazard? Yeah. Um... Or was that the dwarf? Yeah, I think that was. I the got dwarf. the I got the arrow. Got the arrow in the in the eyeball. I like to oh, search for traps arrow in, in my room. Yeah, search for traps in the room. Good move. Yeah. Barbarian searches the area for traps. No traps discovered. Clean. All right. And is the app smart enough to know that if I search for treasure on my next turn, that I'm searching both things, like the cupboard? Yeah, it and searches the entire okay. entire room. Yeah. Okay, then I don't even have to move then. Correct. All right, Jacer. Uh, nine. Going into the room. Yeah. It's, uh... Yeah, five spaces to the door. To the other door. Alright. And search for treasure. Of course. Dwarf. Searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. Holy water. Not too shabby. All right. Uh, Sir Ragnar. Got a four. All right. All right. Where should we send him? To the stairs? Yes. To the stairs. Not like they can get him yet anyway. I mean, I guess a wandering monster. See, but it, they wouldn't be smart enough to have the wandering monster, like, make a beeline for him, try to kill him so that we fail the quest. That's <laughs> what I would do. Well, and that's what I thought, too, when they were coming out. I thought they would flood the corridors. But they just were like, nope, closest hero, just got to queue up behind him. It's like, all right. Yeah. See, they should have just, like, they could... If they've got little sliders for other stuff, they could have sliders for different types of tactics. You know, for... I don't know, yeah. Different strategies. But I'm sure it's it's easier said than done. I've never coded an app, right. so... Couldn't tell you what it's like. But the, but the corridors are coded somehow because you can't search for treasures in them. So it said, right. you know, to push the monsters towards the corridors in this particular quest. Even yeah. if it's not, you know... Or oh, the yeah. closest monster in a corridor. Because there is a quest out there where they put a treasure chest in a corridor because they like make a room out of the out of a yes. in a corridor, and so then it's like it didn't work, and so people nope. are like, "What?" It wouldn't. And uh, yeah, that was. So you'd have to like Keller's get, keep get the quest book okay. out and like read it and be like, "Okay, fine, you get the freaking treasure." Like, all right, thank you. <laughs> the app can't figure it out, but yeah. 
have to put a f special flag on it or something. Okay, so the bard, the pirate. I guess I've been thinking of him as the bard for, for two years, so that's why. Five. He forged them papers at a bard at college. That's right. He's been known to sing a song or two. Song of Sixpence. Pocket full of rye. Four twenty blackbirds baked in a pie. Bard searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. Potion of healing. One red die. Healing 1d6. Good enough. Magnifico. Let's see. Have I searched already? Yeah. Magnificus. Uh, search for traps. Wizard. No traps. Searches the area for traps. No traps discovered. My forces strike in great number. Hero's <laughs> turn. <laughs> Who is that guy? He's delusional, whoever he is. <laughs> all right. Uh, I'm searching for treasure in the room that I'm in. All right. Finally, you get the the one special treasure in the quest. Maybe. Barbarian searches the area for treasure. 60 gold coins. 60 gold coins are yours. Nice. Morgan Catan. Oh, you also find a potion of healing. Stores up to four lost body points. Okay, yeah, I forgot about the double treasures. So heal plus four. I think the most I've ever seen is like three treasures in one, in one like room all at once. Is that because there's both the chest and the cupboard in there? Could be, but I mean, it's also the case that you know you could just cram it all into one piece of furniture or. Not have any furniture and do it. It's completely arbitrary. Hmm. Yeah, we don't have Morgan Katarn. Uh, and I may as well down. move to. All right. Which direction are you going? I'll go up, and I got five spaces, so I could just go to the door that you're right beside. Morgan Katarn. This dead man holds the valley's location. Very intriguing. All right. Jet yep, and that's my turn. All right, Jay, sir. Some of that sweet All right. loot. Uh, dwarf, I got six. I guess move me into the the next uh, three spaces. I'll do this loop too and search for treasure. Very good, sir. Potion of Strength. And what's plus two? Saragnar five. Slowly but surely. Exit the quest. Yes. Ta ching. You have done well, brave heroes. All right, through acts of heroism and bravery, Sir Ragnar has escaped with his life, and you have foiled Ulag's evil plans. Great job, dudes. This Magnus rewards your noble act with 240 gold coins to be divided equally among the surviving heroes. Oh, they let you just end it right there. You have done well, brave heroes. Oh, you can't. At least, at least they give you the choice. Oh, see, you can't uh, just keep playing to, like, get the last ounces of treasure, like, as soon as he leaves. That's interesting. Hmm. Because we always thought that you had to just keep on rolling until everybody left, and so we'd just, like, kind of hang out, search every nook and cranny. <laughs> well, okay, I guess that's, that's game, guys. Uh, good game. Yeah, good game. So, yeah, Sir Death. I, I didn't realize that either. Yeah, but this is just, I mean, this is this, uh, you know, modern interpretation, so. 
you could have played it back in the day any way you wanted. So, you, so Sir Death made it out with 119 gold and a plus four potion of healing, and his helmet, and of course. And Jacer had 50 gold coins, potion of defense, uh, potion of strength, and holy water. And Sir Ragnar had, um, yeah, he had the potion of defense. He gave it back to you. Let's say, let's give that to me. All right. And my pirate had 100 gold, because of course he did, and a heal, 1d6. And he barely used any of his skills, other than the sharpened blades, over and over. I I had my yo-ho-ho and a bottle of rum that I could have used to heal everybody, but I just, uh, just wasn't necessary. And a Magnificus Magnifico, the Magnificent You used it to heal yourself to keep you from dying. Yeah, well, I used the Potion of Healing. I'll but, use the po oh, okay. Because the healing potion is four. The my native healing ability only does two. Of course, it heals surrounding allies as well. So it would have been that. I guess I could have done it that way. Giving um, everybody some rum. Yeah, pass pass the bottle around. So the potion of speed for the wizard. And uh, that's it. All right. So that was our prepare first for future quests, my friends. That was our first outing with the, um, was this on easy or is there even an easy hard difficulty? There isn't. It's just, uh, it's all the same. So let's see. Track hero turns, show damage on monster tokens, enable Yeti hug breaks, which I love. Tangible furniture. Yeah, there's no, there's no settings. Hey, Polsky's here. This guy's gonna start up another quest. If not, cool. If yes, deal deal me in. Well, so I did promise Strange Bus that we were gonna do some stream prep. So I'll let him decide. I don't mean to put him on the spot, but if you guys want to play a quest, we could. Um, but I don't know. I don't. I don't mean to be that guy. So let me uh, let me see what Strange Bus is up to, because. This was a lot of fun. Um, I actually, I mean, I still prefer doing it the old-fashioned way, but it was kind of interesting <laughs> just seeing like how it all works. You know. So let me just check with him here. If you can teach your camera to jump the way that this one does to where the heroes are, that'd be great because it does move right to the heroes. Wait till 11. Well, I mean, we we could play another one. <laughs> Do you guys want to play another one? Sir Death? I could, yeah. You're good for it? Okay. Yeah, I'm used to four-hour D&D sessions. I just might take oh, yeah. a five-minute well, break if that's you're okay. Gonna, you're going to love our channel because we regularly take long, long quests. Okay, so... Are we just going to play the next one, or you've already done the uh, the trial, right? I have, yes. Okay, you want to do the Lair of the Orc Warlord? Sure, we could. All right. With our you... gold totals, did you remember to add the 240? Oh, yeah. For Ed to buy the, the 60, I guess. Yeah, so we each get another 60. Okay, so I've got 160 for the pirate, uh, 120 for the wizard, 110 for Jacer the dwarf, 179 for the barbarian. Okay, so I guess we're going to buy stuff, right? Uh, let me just drop in here. There was the... Thought I had the armory here somewhere. One second. Guys. I'll be back in a couple minutes while you guys decide what to buy. You can use my gold if you want, I since I bought cast. something for myself last time. Join if that's okay. Yeah, strange bus. That'd be cool. What character are you needing to be filled? Well. Let's see. Um, so we had three of us. 
So we had one, but I mean, I can I can jump out and let you, one of you guys jump in and just facilitate. It's actually easier that way. Too bad we can't have two, multiple barbarians in a quest. I'll be good in about five minutes or so. Okay. So we're just going to do a little buying phase here. Just get L. I think the wizard should get a staff. Yeah. That way you can do some diagonal attack. Okay. Can you guys see that? Are you seeing the armory? Uh, yes. Now. Okay. All right. Let's give the wizard a staff. So he's got twenty left. Uh, yeah. if he'll give fifteen to the dwarf, then the dwarf can get a helmet. Okay. Alright, so the dwarf's got a helmet. So you're up to three defense. Remember, you can sell stuff back at half price if you want, if you need the extra gold. I figure we just will retain the same heroes. So, Strange Bus, if you want to take control of... Well, see, we've got we've got a wizard, and we've got a pirate. Okay. So the pirate, his thing is, he gets a bonus if he doesn't have a shield and he has non-metal armor. So what if I buy him a uh, bracers? I guess. But that's like five hundred and fifty. That's super expensive. Probably should just buy him a. Well, he's got his diagonal. One sixty isn't isn't a whole lot. I'm usually the guy who hits stuff. Yeah. <laughs> well, um. Good question. Okay, so you've used up all your gold, Jay, sir. Yes. Did he say that, did uh, Sir Death say that he wanted to give us his gold? Yes, think... that is correct. I've returned, oh, by the way. Oh, I w wasn't going to do it without you here. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay. All right, so you're you're donating to the cause. Well, yeah, it's a group game May as well. Yeah. Greedy. So we got 344 left. So wizard's got a staff. Dwarf's got a helmet. Barbarian's got a helmet. I probably should get a helmet. Okay, so helmet for the pirate. When I was a kid, it was always like, buy the most expensive weapon you can right away. Like, strong offense is a good defense, but in later life, it's like, nah, get get the armor first. Build, build yourself up. Different. Yeah, a lot of, get the helmet first and then try to get a weapon. Okay, so we got 219 left. Not like we have to spend it all. Alright, thanks, Strange Bust. <laughs> hey, it's alright, Strange Bust. Um, okay. 219. Just trying to think what else.
mean, it doesn't have to be perfect. We can always just keep some of our gold. Uh, how about the, uh, wait, is the, the, the... Everybody who can get a helmet has a helmet now. Yeah, no, I was thinking, is the, uh, the, uh, rapier is diagonal, right? Yep. Now, you could, <laughs> Jacer, you could sell your short sword and buy a broadsword, so you could have three attack you wanted that would be most of our gold we'd only have like 44 left but yolo right we don't really need a tool kit because we've got the dwarf yeah uh can't really afford the heavy armor yet i mean someone could buy a shield nobody really has any two-handed weapons yet Except for the wizard who can't use it anyway. Uh, yeah. Buy a shield for the barbarian. All right. You cool with that, Sir Death? Yeah, I am. Yeah. All right. That's why he just upgraded himself to a mummy stat now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so shield. shield. Sir Death. Yep, mummy stats, definitely. Okay, so we've got 69 gold left. Does somebody want to be the designated gold carrier? Sir Death, you're the strongest right now. <laughs> Do you mind carrying it? Sure, I could. And you said, what, 69? 69, dude. The funny number. Yep. All ages stream. All right. Good deal. Okay. So with that out of the way, Strange Bus, are you with us? Are you saying to do it so we can see your counterattack? Do it. Oh, I guess that was an older comment. Sorry. Yeah, so with the combat cards and all that sort of thing, I'm just going to have to kind of like wing it. Um, okay, so Sir Death is the Barbarian. Jacer's the Dwarf. Strange Bus is taking over Grognak the Legend. The Pirate. And I can help him with the uh, special abilities because they are a little different. And who's taking control of the wizard? Is that me or is one of you guys jumping in? Elviler? Elviler, are you there? Yeah, sorry. he said he just needed a few minutes. Oh, okay. Well, I can control him until... Polsky, I guess you're going to be called Char's counterattack. Char equals Char as well. Gundam. Oh, yeah. Okay. I guess we should just get started. Okay, so uh, I guess we'll just have Elviler be the uh, the wizard. I mean, technically, he can change his spells. I guess that's something that like I never did back in the day. It was always just like once you chose your spells, you just kept them for like forever. But theoretically, between quests, you could. Hey, who just joined us? 
That's L. Weiler. L. Weiler. The man, the myth, the legend. Are you okay being a wizard? Hey, can you hear me? Hey. Yes, we can. Cool. Uh, wizard. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. All right. Do you... So I was playing him with fire, water, and earth. You want to change that up, or are you cool with that? No, that sounds good. Okay, so that way you get two heals. You miss out on the genie, but still. That's always handy. Yeah. Okay, so you've got a staff. So do you have your own dice tonight? I do. Let me just grab a character sheet, and I'll write some stuff down. All right. Yeah, I printed out a bunch, bunch more. So you've got a potion of speed, so that's double movement, just like the swift wind, actually. <laughs> um, that's all you've got special, really. All right, staff and potion of speed. Yep. You've got right. fire, fire, water, and earth spells. Yeah, so, I'm just using my cards here. Yep. Okay, so Jacer has three potions. Yeah, everybody can mark off quest two is completed. So potion of defense, holy water, and potion of strength for Jacer. Unless you want to spread those around. I mean, you know, you earned them, you can keep them. Of course, you've only got two attacks, so maybe you would want to kind of boost your attack and defense a little bit. Yeah, I think this will work out nicely. We've got a pretty good, pretty good group. Hello. Hey. All right, you're the pirate. All right, let me uh, finish bringing your stream up to rush on down, so. All right. Ah, and the blue stacks conveniently crashed, so. Oh, no. <laughs> That's uh, something I figured isn't always new. <laughs> <laughs> Joys of technology. Sorry, I'm, uh, once again, conveniently late to the party. <laughs> it's the peg leg. Yeah. And the rum. All the rum. <laughs> yep. yep. I mean, I wasn't going to say it. Felt like it went without saying, but, you know. Why is the rum gone? <laughs> it's all rum gone. All right, I feel like we should change the name, but I think you can't change the name once it started, so death fans it is. All right, Lair of the Orc Warlord, Quest 3. My bad, I know that's tough work. Truly do apologize. Oh, Major Aznable is painting a miniature model. <laughs> They're talking about Gundam. Ooh. I just remember being a little kid and being like, Robotech? It's like, that's for older kids. And I was like, aww. <laughs> Someday, I will revisit Robotech and see what I missed. Alright. There are the Orc Warlord. There I am. Before we start, did you Prince deduct Magnus any more coins besides the... the total that brought it down to 69? No, we still like, got... Did you buy an extra potion? Oh no, we didn't. We didn't buy any potions at all. Okay. I think the cheapest potion is like a hundred gold. Oh okay. yeah. So. No, it's fine. Keep it the funny number. <laughs> the orc warlord Ulog, who was responsible for the imprisonment of Sir Ragnar, be sought out and destroyed. Put it in the title, you might get more views. When Ulog <laughs> is destroyed, the heroes yeah. are to be rewarded. Works with the algorithm. Eighty gold coins <laughs> to be divided among them. 
bunch Any of treasure found in Ulag's stronghold <laughs> may be kept by the finder alone. May be kept by the finder alone. Doesn't say can't give it away. Yeah. All right. So, yeah, I know, uh, Strange Bus, you got to get used to not being the barbarian. <laughs> so, Sir Death, uh, welcome. So, uh, everybody, um, introducing everybody. So, we've got the Strange Bus, who has, is my uh, ranting partner on the rant cast, and a great guy with his own Twitch and his own YouTube empire uh, growing steadily. Um, Sir Death. Uh, the vids, who I've incorrectly referred to in the past as Sir David, um, good guy, and uh, our first collab, so it's awesome that he's here. We appreciate him. Yeah, I'm glad to be here too. Jacer, frequent uh, frequent flyer with us in our wild wild adventures, and of course Elviler, creator of many fine artworks in Elviler.com, with his cool uh, interview recently on HeroQuest. A lot of good content on this page too. And we've Thanks. got it's just a hobby. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't no thing. And then we've got whoa, the fog of war is like freaking out. <laughs> and we've got Comrade Polsky, who is here <laughs> in the chat backing us up, using his channel points wisely to help us out. Major Asnable's painting a miniature. We've got Quiffengogtickles. Thank you for joining us. If cool. unless you're a bot, in which case I hope you get banned, but hopefully you're not a bot and You'll stick um, around. Yeah. <laughs> no, Polsky pointed that out to me. I think I just oh. got that message. All right. Die then. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Except that there's going to be like one guy and it's like, oh, I was the first true artificial intelligence. You violated my rights by banning me. It's like, oh, man. <clears throat> I'm sorry, alien, uh, robot overlord AIs. <laughs> Thanks, Polsky. Yeah. I haven't had time to check the. Uh... Appreciate it bot list today. All so. right. So we're going to have to take out a warlord. The orc warlord Ulag was responsible for the imprisonment of Sir Ragnar. Prince Magnus is ordered to be sought out and destroyed. I'm not sure if it's just my screen, but it, things are a little bit twitchy no, this time. They're definitely yeah, twitchy. I thought I thought it was just me cuz it's it it it's like really freaking out. We're tweaking, bro. <laughs> Where, where's the radical Qatar music, man? After defeating Ulog, all heroes must return to the stairway to finish this quest. Good luck, my friends. We're on Twitch, but it's it's really twitching. Yeah. <laughs> so we're uh, it's like it detects that you're streaming it, and so it starts twitching just because it's Twitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Zoom in. All right, barbarian. I will move first. I rolled eight on my dice, so I'm just going to move up to the door and open up. Uh, four up. All right. What do you think, Tank? I'm just going to stand there. Stand your ground. All right. Jacer. Yo, 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 boy. I got eight. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm the only one without a diagonal attack, so I'll just stand behind the... Uh, Barbarian. All right. As you wish. All right. Strange bus. I got ten. Ah. Okay. So where are you going? Uh huh. <laughs> now you've got a diagonal uh, attack. Yeah, I guess I'll go to the. I'll be at the north of the Barbarian. Okay, nice. And just so you know, you have three special abilities. So you have three skills. You have the sleeping dart, uh, the dart of sleeping venom, so you can put a uh, enemy to sleep. 
You got Yo Ho Ho and a bottle of rum, which heals you and the heroes nearby to body points. And then we found what was really useful is Sharpened Blades, which gives the person you designate one extra attack die for that attack. But that you can get it back. You can re earn the ability any time another hero rolls two white shields. When they defend. When they defend, yes. Not just any time. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So I may I can need to be you. reminded of those. No problem. Okay. And you also have uh, 1d6 healing, so you've got that as well. Nice. Yep. Potion. All right, so you're good in where you are? Yeah. All right. Okay, L. Viler. No one searched this room yet. Well, I rolled a two, so I guess I'll go stand beside the bard. Uh, does the staircase only count as one Pirate. space in the app? Yep. I okay. mean, yeah. It's on the honor <laughs> system. All right. Um, yeah, then I guess I'll search for treasure. All right. All right. Wizard searches the area for oh, nice. treasure. Bonus Draw Ooh. a treasure card. Track <laughs> treasure on your oh, character sheet. Shoot. Because. Oh, no. All right. Oh man, we're gonna have to figure this out. Okay, so there's a wandering monster, and I drew a wandering monster. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna get a monster out. Zargon's turn. Self <laughs> wizard, roll your defend dice. Okay, Elviler, you just got three skulls against you, and you've only got two defend dice. Two, yeah. And I didn't get any. Oh, shoot. This is a You're great a start. <laughs> good thing you got two healings. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But now to, Heroes turn. to simulate... Okay, would one of you guys mind using up your uh, action? Or your... Uh, is, is anybody else... Well, no one's going to... Oh, shoot. We can't search... Never mind. <laughs> I'll figure it out later. Okay, Barbarian. Thank you, Major Asnable. We'll keep that in mind. I was just standing my ground here. Okay. Why not? Okay, you're going to continue blocking the door. Because Zargon hasn't gone yet, has he? No, it'll be Zargon's turn now. Yeah. Oh, you're right. Thank you could you use my... Just spawn in a wandering monster beside me i don't think that i'd actually but search for treasure in this room there's a monster already in the room so you can't really well i i don't think it'll oh right us, yeah yeah it won't let us do it yeah i was gonna like simulate adding the monster to the quest by just having someone randomly search and get a wandering monster automatically okay just have to do it at some other time so just randomly just oh another monster comes out instead of having a dull moment okay jacer you just draw a circle on one of the squares in obs <laughs> just have you fight it oh yeah you know I that's true that's, <laughs> it, would have been, it, it would have been Zargon's turn after the wizard searched for treasure okay. and got the wandering monster oh so yeah double attack you're right you're right it's tweaking it's tweaking hi guys out. it was nice knowing you <laughs> <laughs> oh you're not saying goodbye you're saying goodbye like in the game it's, it's yeah. all soon to be over. Minions of dread, do my bidding! Wow, that was <laughs> Try to defend yourself, barbarian. Roll barbarian. your defend dice. With your four mighty defense. <laughs> all right. And that is two shields. Ching. Okay, well, if I'd used sharpened blades, it's, or, yeah, if... Strange boss, if you had... Okay, so in that situation, if you'd used it up, you would have gotten it back just then. But you've got it. Uh, okay. I'm... Uh, when would be the optimum time to use that? Like, right now? Yeah. Like, when it's... As soon as your, um, your am turn... Am I too late? Well, as soon as it's your turn... <laughs> yeah, you gotta wait for the... See, all they did was just mob the room. Okay. Oh. Defend yourself, wizard. Roll your defend dice. All right, Elviler, you got to defend against one skull there with your two. One. Yes, I got one. Ching. <laughs> Phew. 
Okay. Hero's turn. Hero's turn. Okay, Barbarian can attack. All right. I will attack with my three dice. Two skulls. Yeah, he's dead. And you're dead. The goblin. Has and I'll just continue defeated. blocking that. All right. Okay, Jacer. All right, I'll move. Um, uh, I'll move over one and attack the orc. All right. And one skull. Ching. He blocked it. All right, pirate. So you're wanting to use your sharpened blades on the the old barbarian? Yes. Or use or use it on or use it on the uh, wizard. That means he would attack with two. Because the orc's going to be more dangerous than the goblins. Hmm. Or, well, yeah. There's a couple of different ways you could do it. Or you could just move up and attack the. Uh, Orc, because see, you've got that square in between the heroes where you'd be completely protected, and you could just jab at him diagonally. Can I see sharpened blades though? Um, yeah, but it's it's like it's either that. I mean, either one is an action, so you're either using that or you're attacking. Oh, okay. Um, no pressure, right? <laughs> Well, I mean, you if know, if you want to attack, you could. Yeah. Yeah, let's move. Well, let's move one space, I guess, and attack. Well, two, but yeah. What was it two? Okay. Yeah. yeah roll um, the seven, so it's good. All right. I'll roll for you here. So you're attacking. One skull. He defends. Nothing. Got him. The orc has right. died. Now we just have to fight another one. Not too shabby. Actually, I wonder if this would be a good time to use my monster. Bard searches the area for treasure. Cash in my treasure. <laughs> treasure on your character sheet. Zargon's turn. Defend I'll... yourself, bud. Roll your defend dice. Okay, so you get three defend dice here. Strange bus. Uh, ching. Okay, so you blocked it. Awesome. Foolish adventurers, your fate is sealed. All right, wizard. Elviler. I'm just going to stay where I am. <laughs> it's safe here. <laughs> and show they never left the room. Ever. <laughs> an Elton John song. Make them fall over dead. <laughs> How are you guys feeling? Anybody need a rock skin or something? I don't know, maybe I could use that. <laughs> use it I think he'll be fine with my four defense dice. Yeah. Yeah, you already have rock skin. <laughs> Yeah, you're better off casting on yourself. That at least gives three of us three three defend dice. Yeah, I might do that then. Okay, so rock skin. So that means it's three temporarily until you lose one body point and then you're dead anyway. But you've yep. got two heals to come back. Okay, good. All right, Zargon. Zargon's turn. The goblin misses. Protect yourself, bud. Roll your defend dice. Oh, missed. <laughs> Ching. Blocked it. Hero's turn. All right. Barbarian. Uh, 
I will make my attack on the goblin. That is zero skulls. Two shields, one Zargon shield. Wind defending, okay. Alright. Well, they're just goblins, but there are three of them. Alright, anything else? I don't think I can really do anything else. The tweaking fog. Yeah, I wonder if making blue stacks break again, like making it the black screen for a couple seconds, will fix that. Uh, I'm not sure I want to risk it and lose it for. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Jay, sir. Uh, move down one and uh, attack that orc. One skull. Nothing. The orc has been defeated. Thanks, Joker. All right, pirate. Um, I will. <laughs> Thanks, Polsky. They, they, my, yeah, stay of where I'm at, I think. And then, I think now would probably be a good time to use sharpen blades, right? Sure. Yeah. yeah I mean, those then, guys are gonna go down pretty, pretty easily anyway, but. But yeah, because the barbarian could just take them all out, right? Yeah. Well, we're only in the first room. Yeah, but you got it back. Four hours for the first okay. room. <laughs> World record. <laughs> oh, well, then then I guess I just choose to do nothing. Because there's not much I can do. Except for, you know... You can attack diagonally. That's true. You could, yeah. Oh. If you I want forgetting me to that I can do next, that. Yeah, you if you want me to you. move next turn and let them all through, you could. Or I could do that. Hey. He just runs down the stairs. I like your you strategy. Go. You're thinking smarter, not harder. So I mean, if <laughs> you standing in that doorway works for me either way. <laughs> so do you want to go up by the door then and poke at him? Yeah, yeah, that'll that'll work. And then I could just poke, through, yeah. like beside the barbarian. I yeah, get it because you're work. so used to playing the barbarian. Um, he's not really. All, like, I am tricky like this guy. Stranger but, bus just drinks and shows up late to the party, and then skip leg day. Yeah. Yeah. Occasionally does an RK. Well, you still have one of those traits. <laughs> yeah, well, yes. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. But I get all these extra Lots skills and I don't know what to do with them. Just remind you, be like, hey. Well, one of those skills is drinking rum. <laughs> well, I never said, I didn't say, I didn't know what to do with all of them. Just some of them. <laughs> some of them. All right, you got one skull against the uh, goblin. And the, oh, he got a black shield. ka -ching! Drunkenly pokes at him and ineffectual. Okay. All right, Elviler. All right. Uh, yeah, I will. I guess roll. Yeah, I got six. That's enough to move one square to the uh, west, and then attack. All right, with your mighty oaken staff. <laughs> yeah, with with one die. Uh, white shield. Oh, you missed. <laughs> you missed. It was worth the effort, I guess. <laughs> Scared him. He poked him in the belly and he jumped. <laughs> this little tiny goblin. Hard to hit with my yeah. big oak stick. One second, sorry. One second, sorry. Really trippy looking at that fog for like a long period of time. It feels like the scene just keeps resetting. Yeah. <laughs> like you're in like a time loop. You're just like, oh man, I've got to buy like all Avalon Hill products. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> You're standing in line to buy it and your eyes start twitching. Uh, yeah, man. I must buy another one. It's green. I mean, they were seeing I, I feel like there's a subliminal message that keeps rotating through that fog, and that's why it's like glitching. Yep. Oh, there it is. Buy all Avalon. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right there. 
it's on my third copy of Axis and Allies already. Not a sponsored stream, by the way. Yet. Oh no! Oh, see, see, I, I found out. So if I click full screen, that's what happens. Oh man, I wonder if it saved. Did you break? Oh, did you break it? I broke it. I buy it. Oh, uh -oh. shoot. Well, back and to show. The all of our heroes disintegrated into nothing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Actually, there is a way to fix this because all you got to do is just like kill, 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 kill all the monsters. <laughs> like get back, <laughs> get back to where you were. That was some crazy chaos spell. Yep. So if you maximize blue stacks while running OBS, it freaks out. Apparently. Not sponsored stream, by the way. All of a sudden, explosion. Oh, raid want... shadow legends. No, you don't want kidding. money, do you? <laughs> well, <laughs> and you're dead. <laughs> raid shadow legends. Man, those commercials were annoying. It's like it just that's that's the first thing like, I listen. I hear now when I hear somebody saying not like this. This isn't a sponsor, and then just big explosion takes up the screen, and then you just see Shadow Legends multiplayer. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's like listen. I I, I might have thought about playing your game, but since you annoyed me so much, forget it. <laughs> you and I done professionally. We are we are done professionally. <laughs> oh man, come in here with your light. Da, 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 da. <laughs> da, 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 Let's do the whole routine. Okay, it's doing this problem again. Well, guys, um, we, we meant well. Let me just see <laughs> if uh, we can get it going again. I would suggest TTS, but it takes way too long to set up. Yeah, it takes Especially a if while. you're a new Zargon. Like time. I was. I saw the battle for the oh. night thing briefly. The battle for the night? I saw like all those subliminal apps you keep popping up. Uh. Oh yeah, 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 the uh the ads. Oh now I see Avalon Hill logo and Hasbro. Yeah, yeah, it's not We're getting it's, there. It's not working. Yeah, see, that's why it keeps crashing so that they can show more ads. But it's like, but I'm not getting, I'm not getting anything for these ads. These are just blue stacks. You've met your, your you've met your trial limit. Now yep. it's endless ads. Yep. Please register. Register your shareware. You need to register your copy of WinRAR before you can continue playing. Yep. Yeah, we, are we? <laughs> you're seeing the same thing that we're seeing right now. Polsky is darkness. Oh, it was there for a second. Blue stacks. Yes. Okay, now it's back. And we're back. Yeah, it's back. All right, rescue Sir Ragnar. Ragnar. See, cause I bet. Oh, you jerks. Okay. This was Sir Ragnar. We've... Oh, I didn't save it. Okay. Oh, it didn't even save anything. Until we meet what? again. Take care, my friends. Oh, you finished that one. We had a check mark. Oh, yeah, yeah, we won it again. We got Don't 241 gold. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. 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 Here's what we're going to do. Tread carefully, my friends. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put everybody right where they belong. And yeah. we have killed one or two goblins, right? There were three left, I believe. Right. Yeah, and they were all huddled by the doorway, right? The goblin right? has died. Yeah, so maybe it was only one that we killed. Oh, whoops. The goblin <laughs> has ah. been defeated. Bonus kill by uh, Zargon. He just killed one of his minions. It's the price of failure. It's like, wait, boss. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So you were here, I think. 
remind me. Does this look anything close to what we had? Uh, As the screen catches up. So, Barbarian at the door. Uh, pirate above. I think I was on the... Uh, I side. think I was in the corner by the doorway, because I remember attacking through the doorway. Okay. And failing horribly. Alright, Jacer, where were you at? Did we lose Jacer? I think he was two squares to the left. Uh, well, to the I was another space to the right by the wall. Okay. All right. Wizard was two spaces to the left. Is what I mean. Okay. So after we did the musical chairs, and uh, let's just give Zargon a turn so we can queue up the now, goblin. Now, feel yeah. the wrath And I'd be fine Zargon. forfeiting my turn because I'm sure that I would have been able to get one skull on the goblin. With three Yourself. Dice. Barbarian, roll your defend dice. Oh, okay, he's got a phone call. No problem. All right. Hero's turn. You want to defend? I'll roll up my four defense. Yeah, I rolled a single shield. Nice. All right. Chaser. I just move, uh, I just move. One Prince Magnus over. has ordered that the orc warlord Ulog. Prince Magnus has ordered that the orc warlord Ulog be sought out and destroyed. Oh, it gives you little hints. Interesting. Prince Magnus hmm. has ordered that the orc warlord Ulog be sought out and destroyed. Sorry about that. It just he kept saying it over and over. Okay, sorry. Uh, Jaser. I uh, just one space to the left. Still in the same room, guys. I was almost thinking, like, <laughs> we should just exit and save it and then come back in. But then I'm thinking, like, what if it doesn't save? <laughs> Let's just keep on playing. All right. Um, okay. Strange bus. Oh, how Wrong does bonus religion. mercenary hero work here? Oh, shoot. I was about to mention that. It's, it's not going to work in this quest. Um, Sorry, Polsky. Yeah, we would have to, like... Because I was thinking, oh, I know, I could like put a little icon on the screen, like just superimpose an image and just like move it around. But um, yeah, sorry, Polsky. They only so they added mercenaries to the app, but they only made them work in the Frozen Horror. Because that was kind of a question. It's like, well, couldn't you just use them anywhere? But apparently not. Yeah, we'll save it for the next quest. That's what we'll do. We'll keep track of it. Thanks, Polsky. It won't. It won't go to waste. Okay, um, I guess I'll just try to keep attacking through the doorway. Yeah. Sounds good. Whoop. No! Stop it. It's like he's running away. Sometimes I accidentally roll the mouse wheel and it just starts moving people. Okay. Yeah, so you're going to attack him. Two skulls. He defends. Nothing. Got him. The goblin has been defeated. All right, so we're going to do Elviler. What do you think he should do, guys? Run in, swinging his staff like a maniac, leaping on top of the table. <laughs> Recreating the scene from Flashdance. Like, don't do it. You start skin funky. Yep. Um, I think he. I mean, he could probably take the goblin, but he's only got one body. Uh, yeah, he's better off just searching for uh, secret doors or traps. Well, probably no traps, but secret doors. Secret doors. Okay. Wizard searches for secret doors. No secret doors found. Zargon's turn. Yeah, the AI is pretty, uh, pretty basic. Barbarian. 
Bro, we all defend dice. All right, I'll roll up my four defense again. Not, not a thing. One shield. <laughs> Ching. Not a big deal. Hero's turn. All right. Let him have it. Wipe them out. All of them. All right. I'll attack then. It's my turn. Yeah. Two skulls. And he's dead. The and goblin. Has and died. I got four movement, so I'm just going to move into that room as well. Any... Doesn't really matter where. Just move me in there, and then you guys can get through too. Yeah. Well, just remember, heroes can pass through one another. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Now, in Space Crusade, if you try to... Like, the person has to allow you to pass. <laughs> oh. Actually, I think maybe in the very first edition of Hero Quest, it might have been that way. Like, well, if you want them to pass, they can go by. So it's like, you shall not pass. But in this version, it doesn't matter. If you're on the same team, you can go right through. All right, Jacer. Uh, 12. Uh, I guess move me right to the next door. Right through all those traps, right? Okay, got it. <laughs> Yeah, I'm a dwarf. Yeah. <laughs> Blue, I mean... Red, uh, ah! <laughs> Alright. A bunch of chaos words. No. Okay. Just, just uh, Fimmer. Alright, well, what do you think? You got a monster in your face. Don't forget, you got a bunch of potions, too. You got a potion of strength. Yeah, look, uh... And defense. Drinking potions aren't actions. <sighs> Excuse me. Yeah, I'll drink the potion of strength. Speaking of that, cheers, dead gamer. All right. All right, so three got, skulls. So you rolled five dice and you got three skulls? Or, no, I guess uh, it would be four dice. No, I rolled four dice and got three skulls. Wow, okay. He only has three, three skulls and a shield. You got him. All right. <laughs> The abomination has died. See, now why you gotta call him a, an abomination? I mean, it's so rude, man. <laughs> Alright. The pirate. Grognak. The drinker of grog. The legend? The legendary drinker of grog. Um... Yeah, I think I'll roll for movement this time. Let me go ahead and uh, roll. Alright. Nine. I got it. Oh, I can. Oh, I'm, I can roll now. I forgot. I forgot. Okay. I mean, I got close. I got eight. So. Yeah, we'll give you the nine. Okay. No, I forgot <laughs> you had dice. I'm sorry, man. Um. Yeah. Let's. Um. I guess let's move one space into the room and. Uh, down into the corner. And then check for treasure. Sure, it's gonna be a card, but we'll see. Mod searches the area for right, treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character we sheet. We got out of the first room. Yep, nice. Or yeah, second room overall. If you don't count hazard. stairs. Okay, you or, got a hazard. Count. Found an arrow. A hidden arrow strikes you, and you lose one body point. Yay! Pirates down to four. 
It's only a flesh wound. <laughs> All right, Elviler. All right, eight. Let's uh, enter the room, I guess. And uh, go down towards the door until we can't go no more. Eight, right? Yep. Okay. All right, Zargon, nothing to do. <laughs> my dread forces will block your escape. So it'll be my turn then. Do you dare yep. venture further? Okay, so I'll search for treasure in this room. All right. Potion of healing. So you get a potion Ooh, another of healing. One d six. Nice. And then I will do my movement. That is four. So move me towards the door there. Alright. As close as you can get me because the dwarf's in the way. Yeah. Do you have enough to go through or just enough? To... No, I have just one more. Yeah. We're not using their leapfrog rule, so... I would like to search for treasure. All right. Gold. Amidst old rags, tattered fur robes, and soil blankets, you find a collection of 15 gold coins. So you got 15 total there. All right. And the movement... Got three. Uh, move me three, and I'll open the door. No monsters for once. All right, pirate. Um, let's see. Okay. Roll. Nine. I will go... Let's go straight in and see if we can move out the door. Uh, out the door to the, the south. Out to the south, sorry. Be more specific. Alright. And then... Looks like the northern part is unexplored. Yeah, I guess you keep heading that way. Alright. Um, I don't think I can check for anything in the hallways, right? Uh, you can search for traps or secret or doors. Um, let's check for traps. Good idea. Now, does the system know that we're searching the north? See, how does it know which one you're searching? I don't know. But I think it searches, searches for everything you can for see. Traps. No traps discovered. Oh, you think it searches both? That would be a violation of the rules. Oh, well. Nobody Maybe has that was too hard to program. Maybe. See, they could just have, like, a flash and arrow, like, which one are you searching? Or something. I don't know. It would probably take like hours to program. Okay. All right. Elviler. All right. We got a six. Uh, let's see. Let's go down beside the bard. Pirate. Nobody wants to search that room with the fireplace. Okay. I'm not going to risk it. I have one body point left. Fair enough. Risk it! <laughs> Easy for me to say. All right, Barbarian. I got seven on my movement. 
I should maybe just move out of there and go towards the door on the right there, as far as I can. You mean the left? Or you're going to that door? The yeah, the door room. on the right, south, yeah. Okay. So you want to go completely out of the room? Yep. Alright. Yeah, if I want to search that for treasure, I can get it on the way back. True. If you make it. Seven, right? Yep. Okay. Any searches? As soon as I get there, I'll search for traps, yeah. Okay. All right. Ready for Jay, sir? Uh, I I'll search the room for treasure. All right. Dwarf searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your Jewel. character sheet. You find a small wooden box that is simple looking and very old. Within you discover that it is lined with velvet and contains very small jewels worth 50 gold coins. 50 for Jacer. Alright, uh, 65 so far. 65, dude. Okay. Pirate. Strange bus. Whoops. Uh, can you move me uh, towards the, oh, the, the, the door on the right? I thought you moved already. Did I just miss that? No, I was, I was standing there already. Oh, okay. I just moved you by mistake. Okay, so move you to the door. One, two, three, four. Yep. Open it. Uh, no. Ah, Comrade Polsky is at the ad at in Fallen Order. Nice. He's catching up. Orcs. All right, you discovered some orcs. But you have no actions left, so... Yeah, that's why I said no to the door. Oh, you said no? I opened it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. I could kill these orcs, but... Just shuffle them out of the way and put me there instead if you want. Crafty Zergon. That's an idea. Yeah, it's excellent. You cried to God, don't open the door, but he ignored your pleas and opened <laughs> the door anyway. I, I still have movement, so just move me on the other side of the barbarian. Oh, yeah, you could do that too. Oh, man. Just complete order is broken down into chaos. <laughs> All right. Okay. All that embarrassment aside, let's, uh, let's bring the pirate in here. Oh, well, I rolled a four, and now that there's enemies abound, because I was going to go to the north, I think I'll go uh, go over by the Barbarian four spaces. All right. If they'll allow me to pass everybody, I mean. Of course they will. None of this, you know, deciding if you're going to pass or not in this version of the game. All right. Oh. Well, so you are covering that space in the doorway with your diagonal, but you've also got your special abilities. Oh, so, yeah. Did somebody say that, that Sharpened Blades is reusable? Yes. So oh, every time somebody total, rolls... Isn't it? Two, yeah, every, every time another hero rolls two white shields, when defending, you get it back. And it has to be a hero that you can see, though, so it can't be somebody across the map from you. True. True. Okay, so... Let's just use that on the barbarian. All right. What a good idea. All right, I'll have more chance to kill him. All right, Elviler. Well, I'm going to roll at least a two anyway, so just put me behind the bard, or the pirate, and uh, yeah, I'll just watch the show go down. <laughs> um, you yeah, want some no, rum? I'll, uh, 
Oh, hey, that'd be great. <laughs> uh, I'll search for <laughs> secret doors, I guess. While I'm at it. Can't. It's already been searched for. Oh, it has been? Oh, no, it says monsters are present. What? Oh. That doesn't make Not any sense. Not in the corridor. I mean, that, come on, the pirate, I know he's an orc, but you gotta be good <laughs> discriminatory. <laughs> it says monsters are present. That's, uh... That's a little hateful. Yeah, he, <laughs> that that doesn't make any. There's no monsters there. That's a glitch. Uh, maybe it's maybe it's uh, generalizing the rule. There's monsters present on the board. Let's see, that's not that's not how you play Hero Quest. <laughs> Back in my day, we would have thrown that's you out. That's how they played at Avalon Hill. Yeah. Well, we all know what hate leads to. Yes, anger. Buffering. <laughs> it leads to bu buffering. <laughs> yeah, hate raids lead to buffering. That's right. It's true. You know, before you know it, your laptop's uh, in the driveway. Yeah. And your date. <laughs> All right, Zargon. Zargon's turn. <laughs> I feel like this is a calm before the barbarian. Roll like, your fairly easy so far with this quest. All right, so you got two hits against you, barbarian. All right, I'll just roll with my four. Yeah, not a big deal. One shield, and that's it. Okay. So down to seven then. Hero's turn. No, I had you at four, so you're down to three. Oh, okay. Your yeah, health you doesn't get... recharge between quests. Did I not restore you? Oh, you're right. I didn't. Uh, I forgot to do that. Okay. Zargon, <laughs> where, where's your game today, my man? <laughs> well, You're if the app, to win. the app could get all screwed up, and so could I. Okay, let me just make sure I... Yeah, okay. So I healed the dwarf. I healed pirate. Yeah, you were the only one I didn't heal. All right. Sir that David. is sad. With my four attack dice, I rolled all four shields. See, that should bring sharpened blades back. I don't care what that card says. <laughs> all, right. all four of which shields? Because this might be a situation for a wrestling move. All oh, right. Lion so, shields. Sir Hero Death. Shields. Sir Death, uh, you ever watch the uh, professional wrestling? I do not. Sorry. Ever in your Are life? No. Well, we have a little house rule that uh, if you happen to just be so lucky to roll that many white shields, you get to do a wrestling move against your opponent. So, uh... <laughs> Hit him with the RKO. <laughs> sure, I'll do that. Yeah. Uh, you sneak <laughs> I like <up>. this guy. <laughs> yeah. You sneak up and bam! The ore has been defeated. Oh, he is broken in half. He is broken in half. Oh. All right. You need a sound alert for that. I do. <laughs> oh, oh man. RKO. Yeah. Actually, now that you mentioned, I should just like keep it handy. Sound <laughs> alerts. Just don't play the rocks music. You'll get copyright notification. Not a strike, a notification. second here guys it'll all be worth it certainly hey we got your numbers argon tried to default us but we still got you with the rko <laughs> that's right that's like uh it's like Sir Death said, uh, this seems a little too easy. I have this feeling he's got like seven Chaos Knights <laughs> somewhere in one ready, room. Ready to go. What's an RKO? Oh, man. 
I, I, somebody I feel grab like... the somebody grab a video, and send him the link from YouTube. Okay, I got it. I'm on it. RKO out of nowhere. It's just like a compilation of just like tons of stuff. Hey, kappa, kappa, hey, kappa, kappa, hey. I'll just do this one. Looking for the URL because I see an OBS thing on screen there. Yeah. Oh, went away. Oh, did you see my browser source? Whoops. No, it was just saying connect it to a browser. Yeah, oh. since you've added a browser source. Because I, I might have accidentally, like, given you my extension, so now you can, like, play sounds on my hard drive without me knowing about it or something. I can always change <laughs> <Nope>. it. Nope. <laughs> Hacked. No, we didn't see any of that. I didn't see me playing with my dolls. Good. Whew. Well, there's a link for you in case. All right. So let me just uh, let me just see if this, if this works here. Dashboard. Oh. There it was. Channel points, sounds, my uncle's favorites. And sometimes it does this. Excellent. All right, tell me if you heard it say excellent. Yep. Excellent. Oh, yeah, I was about to say, I can't hear anything yet because I have the stream muted. I've turned on the volume just for this. <laughs> okay, sounds, favorites. Okay. I just need to get it slowly loading. The way they organize it is not the best. It's like by order of like when you added it. Okay, so he sneaks up on his opponent. And look at Randy Orton slithering. Oh, watch, like out, watch, out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out! Oh, come out of nowhere! All right, we had way too much fun with that. <laughs> out of nowhere. Okay, so after all that, um, it is Jacer's turn, I think. Yeah. In all that excitement, I kind of lost track of whose turn it was. Do we lose Jacer? Right in front of the barbarian, my movement was roll was five. Okay. And, and I'll attack the uh, orc. All right. And two skulls. No defense. Got him. The orc has died. All right, pirate. Okay. Just in case I do want to roll for movement. Oh wow, that's a that's a really crappy roll. Um, I rolled a two. Um, would that be enough to get me into the room? Mm, well, if if we do an uncommon feat, you can kind of like leapfrog over these guys. Uh -huh. Wanna try it? Yeah, I take a swig of rum. I'm pretty sure I'm intoxicated enough. Do Let's it. go ahead and do it. Oh, you failed. You tripped and uh -oh. you fell. Clunk. So <laughs> now, you're, now you're over here. And all your companions look at you like you're stupid. You're stupid. <laughs> <laughs> no, just drunk. 
Yeah, there's that. Hold on, Kilo. Okay, uh, Elviler. Got a six. I'll go into the room beside the dwarf and search for traps. Excellent choice. Wizard, searches Nothing. the area for traps. No traps discovered. It's clean. Uh, there's no Zargon to move, so... Back to Barbarian. I got nine on my movement. So that should take me down to the door there for sure. Open? Yes, I want to open it. Goblins. Alright. Two goblins are revealed. Alright, it's a Jacer's turn. I might actually just continue my movement there and go to kill one of them. Oh, you still have it. Okay, which one are you heading towards? Doesn't really matter, just put me in one of the tiles there. They'll both be able to attack me anyways, so... Yeah. Alright. Good? I rolled a single skull out of my three dice. No defense. The goblin has been defeated. All right, Jacer. Uh, what? Let's see. Movement. I got two. All right. I uh, moved me two spaces south. Consider it done. And If it'll let me search for secret doors, search for secret doors. If it won't, because I can see a monster, then that's fine, too. See, that shouldn't matter. You can search for treasure. Yeah, it says mon- yeah. What? So it says monsters are present, so you can't search for secret doors or traps, but you can search for treasure? It doesn't make no <laughs> sense at all. So, it's supposed to be that in the room or the corridor, not I can see them off in the distance. Oh, <laughs> he's watching me. I can't do anything. <laughs> It's like, the, pirate, the pirate allows the treasure, but not the secret right, I'll doors. I'll search for treasure then. If it'll let me search for treasure, I'll search for treasure. Dwarf searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your oh. character sheet. Find a loose stone and tear from the wall right. behind it. You discover a small leather pouch wrapped in an old rag. Peering inside, you find 25 gold coins. Now, if only I was allowed to take tax from that. You know, they keep <laughs> saying that... You can't search for stuff if I'm around. I mean, yeah, it's like you gotta gotta take my tribute. Come on. All right, pirate. <clears throat> All right. Let's see what I got. Oh, that's why I let me search because you weren't in the room with me. <laughs> oh yeah. Bad luck charm. <laughs> <laughs> I got seven. He's a pirate. Let's go He's ahead and uh, He's a buccaneer. He's a marauder. He's a privateer. He's a bad guy. Move into the room. Yep. And uh, I guess I'll search for treasure. All right. I I want to move right next to the door like I did last time. All right. Bud. Searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your you can't character search for sheet. Anything because you're present in the room. <laughs> you can't. You're <laughs> like, oh man, I'm here. I can't do it. I can't bring myself to do it. You have to close your eyes, <laughs> then you can search. Okay, <laughs> 35 gold coins for a gem tucked in the toe of an old boot. Nice. Even, even though they removed the boot from the board, I don't know why. And see, it's digital. They can just put it back. 
but oh well. Maybe in the reprint. See, if they reprint it and put the boot, all will be forgiven. All right. <laughs> that boot is really important to the lore. Just don't understand. Hashtag bring back the boot. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, I'll give you the boot. It's like, wait a minute. Okay, 35. All right. Ilviler. You know what? They can just put a boot tile in the, either the dwarf pack or the wizard pack. Yes! And we'll be cool. This man is genius. <laughs> you hear that, Avalon Hill? Boot tile. Hashtag boot tile. Boot tile. We want our boot, boot back. Tile. Boot tile. Bring back the boot. <laughs> uh, I rolled a six. No, I don't feel like going into that room. Um... Yeah, let's take a risk. I'll go in the yeah, room. Yeah, yeah, this guy. And hit him and uh, hit him with my big stick. All right, where are you moving in relation <laughs> to the goblin? I guess I'll just go right in front of him. Okay, as long as you're speaking softly, that's the key. <laughs> All right. So you're gonna hit him. White shield. Okay, so. I've not does that get me uh, does that get me a wrestling move since I only get one combat die? <laughs> no, <laughs> sorry. It's only for the <laughs> the heavy hitters. Yeah. Oh, you can't use sweet chin music? No. See now the wizard can uh, have strong attacks, it's just that I mean he's gonna have to use potions or magic to get him get in there. You can't just yeah. whip it out any old time. Okay. Zargon. Probably going to attack the wizard that's in front of him. My forces <laughs> strike in great number. Defend yourself, <laughs> wizard. Roll your defender. Unpredictable. Design human uh, choices. Yeah. Hero's turn. All right, wizard. What'd you get? I got one white shield. Nice. This is what the uh, wizard said. He says in the Sorry. <laughs> I'd say that rock skin's been uh, staying put, huh? Yeah, haven't lost it yet. All right. Monster's turn. Or no, we did that already. Uh, hero's turn. What was that? I don't know what that was. I, my stream's muted, so... <laughs> it, was, it was from it was Predator, where uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger's I, like... Uh, I unmuted for a second, and it was loud. <laughs> it was... Uh, is that like is that the predator? Was that the, pre the yeah something for the predator? Yeah. Where he's trying to get his attention, so he's like just like screaming. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I've but, but I do need to look at that one to reach the goblin. So I'm just going to move two squares left. Okay. Oh, I need to put commands in like that. Yeah. And then rolling my attack, I got one skull. The problem is, like, at a certain point, I realized I was getting too meme and it was just like, okay, uh, no defense. It's just like every everything that happens in the game is the a sound goblin effect. has so thought, been well, defeated. I don't want it to be annoying, um, you know. So it's like use them sparingly, but yeah, if it's just the perfect moment, and then you're like scrambling to find it in the long list, and I may as well open up the door too. Since I'm blocking it. Right. Okay, Polsky. Bunch I missed it too, but it's still funny. Bunch of monsters. <laughs> okay, we've got three orcs and a femur. Or an abomination. Now, this would be a good opportunity for sharpened blades. Okay, here I come. Hey guys, I'm just going to go back to the staircase, okay? <laughs> <laughs> come on, we need your magic. Dramatic. Yeah, now is the time more to than just a stick. Bust, busting it out. <laughs> yeah. All right. 
So uh, I take it you have nothing else that you can do, right? Sure. Yeah, I already did. Oh, okay. are you talking to them? Because I already did all my stuff. Okay, so Jacer. Let's see you show yeah. your quality. You've got a potions galore. I got seven. Uh, get defense. Okay, I guess you've got one that you could use. And uh, whatever, whatever you think. All right, I'm moving seven. I guess put me. If put me next to the barbarian or behind the barbarian again, and uh. Let me try to search that room for treasure. All right. Dwarf searches the area for treasure. Hey, potion of healing plus four. Right. And 24 gold coins. Yeah, when I saw that next, it's like, oh, multiples in there. All right. Strange bus. Strange. Let's see. Grognak, the legend. Guess what? I got five. <laughs> um, I'm going to move by the barbarian. And once again, we're going to use sharpened blades. All right. Sharpened up his blades. Okay. Elviler. All right, rolled an eight. Put me on the uh, west side of the barbarian, that is and the then I am going. Thing. Which? Oh, I, you're going to the west side. I was just mentioning that is, from what I've heard, is the best side. Ah, <laughs> I see. <laughs> and then uh, I will cast courage on the barbarian. To change. He's buffing him up. Yeah. <clears throat> and the west side truly has the most stories. Follow the spell oh, card's yeah, instructions. Yeah, okay, fine. All right, courage. Ba -na 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 -na. All right, and uh, the barbarian gets it, and he's like, "I've got balls of steel." Two extra combat dice. Jeez. Yep. So I'm up to all six right now? That's right. That's a lot. Hmm. Should I have given it to the dwarf instead? <laughs> no, because I can't see anything. Barbarian's yeah. in my way. Even though I could probably look between his legs. <laughs> <laughs> I've got balls of steel. Okay, excellent. All right, Zargon's turn. Get ready. Zargon's turn. Self <laughs> barbarian. barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Okay, I will roll my four defense. I rolled two shields. Cha ching Nicely done. Oh, and he also gets his thing back. Sharpened blades. Uh -huh. Zargon didn't bother to give those guys uh, staves. Didn't bother to give the heroes crossbow turn. with poison uh, arrows. What kind of Zargon is this? <laughs> All right, it's barbarian. Time to roll an entire set of combat dice, just for a single orc. That is three skulls. 
He shouldn't have sided with the forces of chaos. And he's dead. How many skulls? Three. The orc has died. All right. Chaser. Seven for movement. They pretty much have a kill box there, so. Yeah. Hey, welcome, uh, Elberg. Sorry, we spent a lot of time in the first room. You you would have been mad. <laughs> Disappointed with us. And then it crashed. So then we had to, like, fight our way through. Well, we kind of cheated our way through to get back to where we were. But it's because blue stacks crashed. But anyway, welcome, at, welcome all. We're playing the companion app here on uh, HeroQuest fans. We got Sir Death of Sir Death Vids here. Uh, Strange Boss, he just stepped out for a second. He'll be back. El Viler's here. And I'm here. And J Sir J. Alright. Yeah, we got the kill box. I going. Was search for uh, secret doors. Alright. You might have already done that, but no, I guess he didn't. Okay, my bad. Dwarf searches for secret doors. See, no secret doors each, found. Each room really should only be searchable once for that, but whatever. I mean the app does a fairly good job. There's a few things that could be better. But it's not too bad. It's it's evolved to a pretty good place. All right. So Strange Bus is taking a break, or are you back? Strange Bus. If not, I'll take his turn. Okay, I'll take his turn. All right. Um, let me see. So I should probably use Sharpen Blades on you again. Yeah. We'll just do that. So sharpening up the Barbarian's Blades. Which, by the way, Barbarian Blades is the original name of the Frozen Horror. Oh, cool. Yeah. Okay, and I really don't need to use movement. If anybody gets close, I can just poke them with the Cutlass. All right, Elviler. Yeah, I'm just... They put. Can I search for treasure, or is it going to complain that the uh, the box <laughs> are there? <laughs> uh, let's find out. Monsters well, are present. probably going to be a why. It's probably going to be a wandering monster again, anyway. So, see, the problem. I mean, I, I don't think this will cause a problem, but sometimes people look at the app and they go, "Hey, well, there. That's the will of Avalon Hill. This is how the game must be." But that's not how it's played. <laughs> the fact that there's any monsters anywhere on the board doesn't stop you from searching the room. It's just if it, they're in the room. Programming yeah, errors. For some does reason, it doesn't it, it doesn't stop the search for treasure. It only stops secret doors and traps. And he's only got line of sight maybe on the one orc. Oh, wait a minute. So, sorry, were you trying to search for treasure? Oh, well, we can do that. Oh, okay. Wizard searches the area for treasure. Am Draw I crazy? A treasure did, it, card. did it just Put not show treasure it? treasure on your character sheet. I don't know. I wasn't looking. Uh, okay, so sometimes you may have to click it twice. All right, gem. Tucked in the toe of an old boot, you find a valuable gem. Stone is worth 50 gold coins. 50. Nice. Okay, so now everybody's got some gold this quest. All right, monsters. Sargon's turn. Self barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Okay. I only rolled one shield there. Okay, so you're down to five. Hero's turn. All right, barbarian. Sir Death. I shall return the hit with about a hundred times more damage. Hopefully, let's see. One, two, three, four skulls. Mm. 
the orc has died. Overkill. <laughs> All right. Stay in put. Yeah, may as well. All right. I Chaser. figured it would be helpful on the abomination. Yeah, but the orcs are moving in first. Send the cannon fodder in first. All right, I rolled a 10. Excellent. All right, I'm going to move nine spaces and go between the orc and the femur. And the femur, femur. All of those are correct. Okay. Or the, or the abomination. <laughs> That's also correct. Ish. Yeah. Like if you're in Italy, it's Sir Manfred. All right. So who are you attacking? Uh, let, let me attack. Let me attack the orc. All right. I have probably a better chance. Uh, one skull. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on one second. Let me caution you. If you kill that orc, though, then the barbarian can no longer see a monster. So technically, it should douse his courage. Oh uh, no! Um, I want to move nine spaces. So you want to move? Completely? I want to be, yeah, uh, around the uh, around him. Strategy. I would <laughs> argue no that the barbarian can see over the dwarf's head. See, now I would agree with you as well, but I'm just not sure how strict. <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's got really tall hair. He's got like a big mohawk with like feathers and like bells. It's a slayer. Yeah. Oh, the declaration on the top Chaos, of his helmet. Chaos Dwarf. He's got like this giant, like, yeah. Well, all the like, dwarf, the Warhammer the Dwarf Slayers had the big mohawks. Yeah, so it's like they're not, they're just as tall as everybody else. It's just that it's mostly like headgear that creates that effect. All right, so now you're gonna attack him. Yep, I got one skull. All right. No defense. All right, another one down. The orc has died. Got him. All right, strange bus. Hi, I've returned. All right, um, and it's and it's your see. turn. Oh, good. Fine. Let me uh, go ahead and uh, roll here. I got seven. Um, oh, uh, barbarian still in the doorway. Um, well, can't really do much, can I? You can search for treasure if you wanted. Apparently. I, mean, I yeah, would say you could enter the room, but you are an orc, so you can't go through the heroes. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Man. All the orcs are going to unsub from our channel now. Thanks. <laughs> hey, look, Grognok can search for everything. Grognok the legend yeah, searches for what he wants, when he wants. I'm a, I'm a legend. A legend. Once again, he is the legend. Um... Don't blame me. The developers put it in the app. <laughs> they hated him so much. <laughs> it's like you, well, let's, you uh, hate him. Let's enter the room and fight the fight the monster. Then it's like those guys who programmed NBA Jam. They like didn't like the Bulls, so they made them like a weaker team. <laughs> Even though they were like the top team at the time. Uh, all right. So you enter the room. Uh, where would you like to be? Does it matter? Uh, opposite side of the of the dwarf. Okay. Opposite side. Oh, I see. Flanking. Yep. Got it. All right. Then what? You uh, put, him, put him to sleep. Go ahead or... and attack him. Attack him. No, no. Okay. I, no I'm not. I'm not the bard. I don't feel like singing him a song. I'll, oh. I'll attack him. Shoot him with a sleeping venom. 
Okay, yeah, go ahead. Two combat dice. All right, what'd you get? I don't. Ha I don't have the hero quest dice for, oh, for rolling that. Oh, you've just got the Sorry. dice. That's right. Just the, yep. Okay. Okay, you missed. Should have had the hero quest dice. Darn. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did use hero quest dice. What am I saying? I guess you can simulate them on uh, red dice, uh, regular d6s, but it's not as much. Worn up would be skull. Yeah. Um, or one through three would be skull. Four, five, you could do white shield. And six, you could do black shield. It's or or the opposite. Yeah, yeah. it's kind of hard to remember when you're tired, or had a little bit of the bubbly, or both. Or both. <laughs> but yeah, was, or both. Okay. All right, Elviler, save us from this madness. Oh, there's only one in there. What's the Harmon going in and throwing a fireball in his face? <laughs> okay, I rolled a five. Uh, let's see. How embarrassing you, would it be if we all missed? Me <laughs> up in the up in the corner, uh, where the where the pirate is. Yep. We should still have line of sight there. I'm gonna say yes. Now the question is, will the app say yes? <laughs> if it question. doesn't, I'll just uh, make, move you to where you are. Yeah, we'll so just see gonna... the. We'll call this play testing. All right. <laughs> so you're gonna shoot him with ball of flame. Yep. All right. <laughs> Failed. You just just got blown up. The abomination has been defeated. All right, blew him up. Nice, nicely done. Put these spells to good use. Okay, monsters. Which there's none. Zog on so it's my turn. Yep. Foolish adventurers. And I got Your seven on the dice. Sealed. I like it. If you click on Zargon, even though there's no monsters, he get, like starts gloating. It's like it doesn't matter. It doesn't I'll matter move towards the door there. Okay. And open it as well. So he's taking the most direct route. First Chaos Warrior and Ulog. Oh, we found him already. The Orc Warlord Ulog unleashes a ferocious <laughs> war cry through gnarly teeth and tusks, dude. <laughs> As of all, I give up. Go ahead, call him an abomination. I hope he sits on your face. <laughs> <laughs> well, now. Spicy. Now, this is definitely a situation where I want to stand my ground. I'm not rushing in there to die. All right. Oh, what, you don't want to fight, uh, you don't want to fight Ulag, the, the fearless? Yeah, I don't want to fight a boss and a Chaos or Dread Warrior and two oh. Goblin minions. We should have opened that door before your spell, your courage wore off. Oh, so it's now like you have you no courage. Sort of see through. Well, now you've got many other mighty spells. You've got Fire of Wrath, you've got... Um, Hill of Mist, Pass Through Rock, Heal Body, Water of Healing, and Sleep. Sleep. Hmm, interesting. And yeah. Bard also has a sleep as well. Yes. Double sleep. Double sleep. <laughs> so you could try and <laughs> make two of the biggest <laughs> monsters sleep there. If yeah. you can get in there. Well, you guys decide.
All right. So, Jacer? Uh, uh, let me search for... Uh, let me move... Uh, uh, three spaces. Next, uh, in that nice spot there. Next to the wall between the wizard and the barbarian. And I'll search for treasure. All right. Dwarf searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. Unfortunately, you didn't find a loaded cannon, but you did find a loose stone and tear it from the wall. Behind it, you discover a small leather pouch wrapped in an old rag. Peering inside, you find 25 gold coins. All right. He's going to fashion himself some golden armor. I think I almost have enough for a shield. Mm, could be. Do you uh, do you want me to pass cast through rock on you next turn, and then you can <laughs> sneak up behind Uleg, <laughs> <laughs> or you know another uh, large character? Does it say okay? So yeah. it does. It doesn't tell you all of Uleg's stats, just that he defends with five. Of course, you got the Chaos Warrior and a couple of goblins. No threat there. All right, pirate. Let's see. Sorry, I'm like doing this and trying to make sure that the temperature in our house is going down because it's hotter than excuse me pardon me like it's hotter than the devil's asshole outside so i'm trying to like he's not wrong we're all sweating in here yeah i got six well and i have a and big like, bag of like flaming hot cheetos and it's not helping oh you want it to be outside and inside that's good <laughs> <You're dead. laughs> all right so we got six um well, I guess I'll just uh, I'll keep repeating my strategy. I go ahead and fortify my position next to the barbarian in the corner over there, and uh, sharpen blades. I don't think you can. It was used up while you were gone. Oh, it hasn't been. It hasn't. Is it or is is it not? It's it hasn't been recharged. However, however, oh, damn. in that spot that you're in, you actually have line of sight to the chaos warrior. You could. Use a sleeping venom dart and put him out of commission. Okay, let's do that. All right. Can someone take out that goblin so that I can uh, stand in the doorway and put the other, the other big guy to sleep? All right. Nicely done, sir. Okay, Elviler. Oh, yeah, you don't have line of sight to anybody. No, so I'm going to cast Pass Through Rock on Dwarf. Okay. And then just stand here. <laughs> uh, right. Or, well, let me see. Yeah, okay, rolled a seven, so put me uh, behind the Barbarian. Please. Okay, one second here. Get past the rock. Yeah, no worries. No rush. The door may now pass through rock. Okay, and then where did you want him? Uh, just behind the barbarian. All right. Monster's turn. My goal is to destroy you, heroes. I think it was cool, though, that we did have people trying to cash in stuff, even though we were using the app, because we had to come up with creative ways to make it work. Mm. Welcome, yeah. LT Pilot. Um, some of that stuff, yeah, buying mercenaries wouldn't work, um, but we'll just no. save it for the next adventure. But you guys don't have to hold back just because we're using the app. I mean, if you've got channel points you want to spend, just I would just say, yeah, try to try to think of something that, yeah, we could do like outside of the game to make it happen. I don't know if that makes sense or not. We'll, we'll try to do it. We'll try to accommodate you. 
the Zargon cards would work. Defend yourself, barbarians. Roll your defend dice. Uncommon feats. Yeah, we just have to within think, reason would work. Think ahead, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and and potions or buying potions works. Yeah, anything that just manipulates body points or uh, attack rolls, um, defense rolls. Yeah, a lot of stuff will work still. With right. my four defense dice, I rolled four skulls, so I'm down to four body points. Wow. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Chaos Warrior's still asleep. Just giving it time to catch up here. Yeah. Heroes See if turn. anything else happened. Alright, Heroes turn. Okay. Three skulls on the goblin right in front of me. Toasty! The goblin has died. Yeah. Okay. You gonna stay put? Probably, yeah. If Wizard wants to go in there, he could. Well, why don't you go in, a, go in a space? Yeah, sure, maybe I will then. I don't think I need to roll movement dice when it's literally it's minimum space. two movement. It's like both your dice like fall into like a, a sewer grate. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> uh, okay. Jacer. Five for movement. So I guess I'll go up two and right one. Oh, my thing fell off. Oh. Hate it when that happens. All right. The pastor rock. I got an easy solution. I'll just pretend that you got a scroll. And we'll use it on yourself. The door may now pass through rock. Okay, where are you going now? Up to right one. Oops. Ah! Stop it. What? Okay. I sh didn't mean to do that. Uh, you won't be able to pass through the monster, but you can go like uh, no, that. No, up, up to. That's you're going down. <laughs> I know. Okay, and then right one. Yes, and that'll put me right behind you. Log, you lag. He's like just just running laps around the building. It's like, what are you doing? <laughs> building just up momentum. Teleporting running. through the room. <laughs> building up momentum. Okay. All right. Now, what were you gonna do? Attack him. Uh, attack you lag and two skulls you lag he just he did kind of just like ping through the room a little bit <laughs> okay how many skulls two Cha ching blocked them both i mean you should get a surprise attack too ah <laughs> uh, you didn't tell me on common feet so <laughs> yeah. sorry no backstab? Oh, man. You had to bring up the backstab. <laughs> Hit him with the backstab. It's, it's the only way to win. All right. Now that it's been patched. Okay. All right. Pirate. Maybe you've got a backstab. Well, let's see. Ew. Oof. Okay. Um, where am I on the board? I know that I'm down there, but I'll, I'll, can we zoom out just a tad? Whoops. Just make you run around okay. in circles a little bit. Yeah, so that that Chaos Warrior is completely vulnerable. Well, I can only... Well, yeah, I can only move two spaces. Oh, I get it. Uncommon mm. feet. <laughs> yeah, let's try it. Let's do it. All right. Jump over the barbarian. All right. Okay, roll your. Oh, you. I got to roll for you. 
It's a skull. You Sorry. get it. You did it. You got it. So you yeah. vaulted right over his mighty head. All right, there you are. And then, uh, can I do an? Oh no, I can't do an uncommon feat. I already did one. <laughs> yeah, I so let I'm Bob Martin do that one time, but after that, no more. <laughs> <laughs> let's do. Uh, let's just attack him then. Yeah. See, I mean, there could be something like you do a series, but like each time it would have to be like less and less likely. <laughs> okay, so you're just. I guess you, could, you just lower the chance, right? Instead of fifty percent, it's like twenty-five percent. Yeah. 15%. Yeah. Skull and then a hero shield. And then if you want a third one, you got to roll the black shield. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> yeah. The, the die has to like land on its edge. It's like, I, I mean, it happened. <laughs> okay. So, lightning has to strike twice in your area. Yeah, catch lightning in a bottle twice. All right. One skull and he has no defense. So he just takes a hit. So. Nice. Oh, we can't change his body points. Oh. All right. All right. All right. Hit the plus for the damage. Whoops. Oh. Yeah, I did, and it just put a skull there. Okay. Oh, so, oh, it keeps track of it. I see. I see. It just when it gets to the maximum, then he just dies automatically. Ah, so when you heal him, you just subtract it. Yeah, it does work. Cool. Yeah. yeah, so they had to they had to think of all those things. Okay. All right. Elviler. All right. Uh, let's let's move into the doorway. Just one space, and then I will. Well, uh, who does anybody need? Uh, Healing magic. You need healing magic. Well, uh, I use it automatically if I die. That's true. Uh, the barbarian's down to four, so he could use four health. That's true. All right. He does have two healing potions, That's... though. I mean... Yeah. Yeah. Well, if you're good, I'll I'll save it in case of emergency, and then just swing at the goblin. Hey, I got a skull. Oh, I got a black shield. Ching. Oh. Ching. -ching. <laughs> I guess that's all for me then. Yep. Okay, Zargon. Zargon's turn. Defend <laughs> yourself, barbarian. Roll your defender. One hit, barbarian. Okay. Can't worry, sleep still. Shields <laughs> and also sharpened blades is back. Roll your defender. Yeah. Nice. nice. Okay, and Ulog just struck four hits against the against Jacer. Oof. Uh, quickly drink your potion of defense. I mean. <laughs> Can I drink that now? I'll give you a chance to go for it. So you get two extra. All right, extra two extra, so that's five dice? Yep. All right, so I got a chance. I got three shields. That blocked three of them. Okay. Take a damage. Okay, so you're down to five. Prepare to meet the unknown! All right. I guess that was it for the monsters. Do I get a wrestling move or an eye poke or something? An eye gouge? <laughs> Wait, what'd you what'd you get? I got three shields. I blocked three of them. Oh! I only took one damage. Snap. Okay. Um. Can I give an old school eye gouge? Sure. So I took a damage. He takes a damage. Yep. <laughs> How very crafty of you. <laughs> My turn now? Yep. Is furniture tangible or intangible? Like, can I move past it? 
it's it blocks movement. Oh, okay. I mean, it is a table, but it'd be an uncommon feat to jump over it. I may as well try that. What do I need to roll? Uh, one combat die. Okay. That is a skull. Alright. Successful. Okay, so... Oh, I also need to see movement first before I do that. That would yeah. be a good thing. Seven movement. Yeah, I could do that. Alright. Do you get on onto the table? Yeah, sure. And then what? If I have enough movement, I'll actually go right beside Ulog there. Which I should with seven. All he right. jumps off the table. Oh! <laughs> the double axe handle. Actually, it's a sword and a shield. And I'll swing my three dice. One skull on him. Alright. One skull. He'll probably block that. <laughs> he rolls five. Believe it or not, no defense. Whoa. He only had two body points? Oh, I forgot. Wow. Quick, somebody buy him. Oh, buy him. Really? <laughs> yeah, he only has two. I forgot. You know, he's got boss... five defense, but he's only got two body. I thought he had at least three, like a gargoyle. Yeah. He's nope. dead? He's dead. He's been defeated. <laughs> wow. He's dead. That was easy. <laughs> Um, and then all of a sudden, out of the blue, eight chaos warriors <laughs> show up. All well, the doors still, open. We still have to deal with one. Yeah! With that, the once mighty warlord lets out a final roar before collapsing onto the stone floor. Ulag. Defeated. Excellent. Oh, and then they force you to go back to the stairs. Oh, as soon as he dies? <laughs> yeah, so you could just run away. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you don't fight the kid? The, you don't fight the other enemies? It's not. Of course, they are blocking your path now. Well, I guess you could step over the sleeping guy, I would say, but it's me. I give you a I potion if I could. I ran out of space in my forever pocket. Uh... See ya, bro. We just start walking away. Yep. Okay. I mean, we could take care of them, and there's that that room up there we could check out. Yeah. All right, barbarian. Excuse me. He moved and killed Ulag. Yeah. So somebody oh, else's turn. Whoops. <laughs> Where's my head at? Okay. All right, I'll I'll take a step towards the uh, goblin. And one skull. And he's dead. And he's dead. And he's dead. The chaos warrior starts thinking sweet dreams, unknowing of his certain doom. Yep. He's dreaming of a better future. Isn't that a David Bowie song? Could be. I'm not sure being uh, covered in your uh, fellow minions uh, <laughs> blood while you're sleeping is uh, pleasant. But <laughs> That's a great I guess it could be. Chaos Warrior. I mean, yeah. he fell asleep almost before the battle. So, like, he could just be dreaming that that, that blood is like jelly... Or chocolate sauce, whatever chaos warriors eat, and you know that us hacking him to death is whatever lets something pleasant before he dies. You know, you never know. Here's a bit David Bowie yeah, song. Yeah, favorite sounds. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. So the pirate. Um. Yeah. I'll. Uh, 
the sharp can I do sharpen blades for the um or is that well, would that even be a thing anymore? Because like nobody's attacking, right? That's defense. Well, yeah, they stabbed the uh sleeping Yeah, let's just an attack. Let's just attack, yeah. Alright. Attack him. One skull. Alright. Okay. Wizard. He's got one hit. Finish him. All right. Uh well. Let's uh shoot the shoot him with a finish him. Just to use it. Yep. Cleansing flame. Because fire fireworks are cool. Yeah. Spell break is successful. He blocked it in his sleep. Man, <laughs> what? How does that work? <laughs> he rolled over and it was like. <laughs> <laughs> so scorched the floor like, where he was sitting. <laughs> I like stabbed him and he like kind of twitches and rolls over <laughs> as he like and just misses. The blood spray like puts out the fire. <laughs> I, All right. I don't know. Well, like that. I rolled a, a uh, break today. <laughs> I rolled 11 for movement. Can you put me behind the dwarf or the barbarian? Sure. I'll use them as a meat shield. Very ah, good. excellent. I'll, I'll Just say in go case diagonal. he wakes up. Go diagonal. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's a good idea. I'll go diagonal. Although, isn't the table intangible right now? No, uh, only to you because no, you have that was just for your uncommon feet. I just oh, okay. it. Oh, yeah. Because it's not really like you're passing through the table. It's just like to simulate you jumping on top of it and mm -hmm. doing a somersault down. And... and diving over to Sleeping Chaos Warrior to attack you alike. Yeah. <laughs> Stabbing him right in the face. All right. All right. So what are you doing? You moved. Oh, I'm done. Yeah, oh. I cast the spell. Do you I can't fire do That's right. That's right. You've done it all. All right. Let's see if he wakes up. Minions of dread, do my bidding. Failed. See how come he gets to roll three red dice? I don't get that. He has three mind points. Oh, of course. Gosh. <laughs> I, I guess I don't deal enough with magic because I always forget that sort of stuff. Like, or I do it wrong. Paralyze in four. each step yeah. you take. Yeah, you're right. Good. And time to hit him with my three dice again. Yes. That is all three skulls. You cut his head off. <laughs> The dread warrior has died. Brutality. Was there enough resistance there to stop your sword before it hit my head now? <laughs> <laughs> the explosion, like, threw you, the shockwave, like, threw you back. With his body just detonating. Yep. And now we're all covered in blood. Yep. <laughs> all right. Like Dracula did. Good, you've it. ruined my rum. <laughs> Blood rum. Great. This is just great. <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, with that. Oh, and I can still move, too. You can still move. I got four for movement, so just move me to the top door there. Ah. And open it, too. I remember this. <laughs> And then that's where I'll end my turn after it's opened. Jacer. All right, let me uh, do my movement. I got three. I guess put me next to the barbarian and I'll search this room for treasure. Very fine. Dwarf. Searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. 
Hazard. You, suddenly a stone beneath your feet gives way. You fall into a shallow hole, losing one body point. End your turn. So, spike pit. Oh, I'm down to uh, four. Yep. All right, pirate. Um, I guess I'm following them. So let's go ahead and roll for movement. Um, got a six. I can't... You want to go into the room? Hey, you can get. The, you can actually get in there. <laughs> Yeah, let's uh, go into the room, and we're going to check for treasure. Because I still live the PSK way. That's right, treasure and fight. Bod uh, searches that's, the that's area fine. for treasure. Draw Wizard would want to search for traps. Treasure on your character sheet. Okay, I'm going to just step in here, because there is a correction that they never made. Um, would you... I'm going to give you a choice. Do you want to draw a card, or do you want to search the chest oh let's search the chest you found 100 gold coins Ooh. boom congratulations yeah in the european version that's what it was there was there's actually an error that's never been fixed like all this time but it's like an unmarked chest is just like any other piece of furniture you draw a card but i think that's a better better deal all right cool yeah I usually just keep drawing until you get a treasure out of the deck. <laughs> if it's like one, if it's that chest is there, I just draw and oh, okay. here's the treasure. So it's either a potion or gold or gems. Because mm -hmm. you think you feel like it, it ought to be something. It ought to be something. Yeah. Um, yeah if you get a trap. hazard, then it's a trap chest. Yeah. But yeah, I don't you count open... the wandering monster. You open up the chest and like you fall into it <laughs> at a false bottom. You're like, well, maybe if I put my foot in here, ah! <laughs> or as you're searching, I guess it, like, if oh. I got a mimic, if you could do a mimic, I guess that could be the wandering monster. If hey. there's a chest, oh, that'd be sweet. Yeah, if the furniture's moving around chasing you. Okay, wizard. All right, I rolled a four. Is that enough to get me in the room? Yes, yeah, it I is. think so. All right, let's go in there and then search for treasure. All right. Draw a card. Gold. 15 Yay. gold coins. So you got 65 total. Awesome. All right, nothing for Zargon to do, so back to the Barbarian. I'll just search for treasure in the room that I'm in right now. Sure, why not? Nothing! Despite a thorough search, you find nothing. And yes, that is like <laughs> homebrew card. Good try, though. And I'll move. And we have to go back the way we came, right? Yeah, back to the stairs. Okay. Oh, there's so a that secret is door that can make it faster. Movement. So move me as far as you can. What was it? Nine. Six and a three. Yeah, it's pretty much a dead end. Slew, slew uh, El Ulog and his uh, retinue. Okay. Chaser. Five, I guess. Move me one, two, three spaces into that room, and uh, I'll search for treasure. Okay. All right. Which which squares are you wanting to go on to? I. Uh. I guess right above the bard. Dwarf triggers a trap. You fell into a the pit trap. The floor gives way. <laughs> Lost one body point. Down to three. If this is gauntlet, it'd be like, Dwarf, you are greedy. Yep. They probably surrounded a chest with them stupid pit traps. 
Well, see, this was the year. Try to cram everybody in there to try to get treasure. See, originally it was supposed to be. Them. It was supposed to be a furniture trap, not a like a pit trap there. But <laughs> you guys were all trying to get it, rather than like each person going uh, out. I have extremely long arms. Now, the pit is like a room unto itself, so it could be searched on a turn too. All right, pirate. Okay. Got nine. Let's go ahead and go back the way we came. Head towards the staircase. All right. And avoid the traps on the way out. <laughs> yep. Wizard. All right. I rolled a five. So, yes, get me as far as I can and. I'll bring up the rear, guys. Hey, uh, if you guys want, I'll just give you like free movement at this point. So you can each just move 12 squares, if that's easier. Sure. All right. Barbarian. I'm just going to go the max that I can until I reach that one room that I said I was going to search again, if I can reach it this time. If not, just bring me the 12. Almost. Jacer. Uh, let me search for treasure. Hell yeah. And it lets you do it. Thank you, guys. Dwarf searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character Ooh. sheet. Wandering monster. <laughs> <laughs> and you are all by yourself. Ooh. And I'm down to three body points. Yeah. <laughs> well, and the other thing is you defend with one less. Zargon's right. turn. <laughs> Misses. Ah, he missed though. Oh, you lucky fellow. Hero's turn. All right, barbarian. Into the room. I'll just keep moving, yeah, until I get that room, and then I'll search for treasure. All right. Were you searching this room? The fireplace room. Yep. Okay. Barbarian searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track treasure on your character sheet. Honor monster. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Coming now, back. Now, fear <laughs> of Zargon. Defend <laughs> yourself, <laughs> barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Yeah, now we gotta kill the ones that were hiding. Ulog from, you know, it's a trap. from the afterlife is like, what were you guys waiting for? <laughs> hey, lotion master. I did roll, What's going on? I rolled two shields with my four dice there, so I'm safe. Cha-ching. Bard see it. It's turn. <laughs> Bard didn't see it. It didn't happen. All right. He's not writing a song about that. Jay, sir. Uh, I'm going to go two spaces, so I'm out of the pit, and attack the orc. Alright, that's the spirit. And one skull. I think I only rolled two, like, twice. Hey, uh, Kurgan, what quest are we doing again here? Uh, this is the orc warlord, quest three. The orc has been defeated! Killing the guy that that captured Sir Ragnar. Yep. All right. Ragnar the Red. Yeah, Ragnar the Red. Okay. So, all right. That was it for you, Jacer. You got him. Pirate. Yep. Um, roll. Okay, nine. I don't know. Were you give me? You give me twelve, right? Or no? Are we yeah, not doing that? Yeah, I'm, I'm there's giving monsters. Well, he's dead now. So, or er, oh, oh okay. in, on the board anywhere. Yeah, yeah. You're right. Nine. Okay. 
Let's just keep heading for the staircase. Um, once I, if I get close enough to the monster is still alive, we'll go ahead and attack that. But um, let's just keep heading towards the staircase. Wait, I'm not sure why I did that. And I'm going backwards. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing the moonwalk. He's strutting his stuff, showing off. Still got it. Still got it. All right. Wizard. And I force pulled the wizard. <laughs> All right, wizard. Mm -hmm. What'd you get, Alviler? Five. All right. It'll get me just through the door, I guess. <laughs> Plus one, I guess. All right, Zargon. Zargon's turn. <laughs> Self barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Two hits, barbarian. Another two shields somehow. Ching. One of these times, I'm just gonna Hero's say like turn. the orc like hacks off his own arm. The arm drops to the ground, sprouts, grows into like buds into like another orc. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it's like ah! <laughs> you didn't know that was part of the lore. Guess what? I did. Yeah, they're fun guy. <laughs> part fun guy, anyways. Maybe. Allegedly. Well, maybe they're only half size. They're like grotch. <laughs> <laughs> you cut him in half, and he becomes two grotch. He chops well, off his arm, of... it falls to the ground, is like, oh, it's not canon anymore. <laughs> Ow. Speaking of cutting him in half, I got two skulls on my attack as well. <laughs> Dude, I want your dice. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you got two skulls. All right. Yeah. Keeping us moving along. I appreciate that. Okay, uh, nothing. You got him. The orc has been defeated. Yeah. Well, in Wizards of Morkar, there is one spell where it's like the monster gets killed and then like his skeleton just like rises up and attacks you. So it's like, you know. Oh, that's cool. Sometimes there's little tricks like that. That's cool. I do that with mine where all the undead have a chance to rise back up. Mm -hmm. Roll a combat die. If it's a shield, the monster just lays there. And if it's a black shield, it gets back up. If it's a skull, it dies or disintegrates mm -hmm. and my kids will sit there and just attack it the body while it's down so i'm like all right it's dead and it can't get up now because you hacked it to pieces yeah <laughs> like the they've seen enough horror movies that you know the jump scare let me just get really close to the the villain's body just to make sure he's dead <laughs> ah! <laughs> Son of a, ah! okay all right jacer um, let me search to... for traps before I move anywhere else. <laughs> I guess we're back to free movement again. Dwarf Nothing. searches the area Clean. for traps. No traps right. discovered. I'm good then. See a pit with uh, some like blood stain. Let me, let me move. Let me move one space over to the door. Okay. That's it. Yep. All right. That's it. Action and movement. That's it. Uh, can I do an uncommon feat and try to search for uh, secret doors? All right. Roll one combat die. Uh, skull. Good. All right. Bard searches for secret doors. No secret Wait, doors found. Do I had the wrong one selected. Let me do that again. Dwarf searches for secret doors. And then I started searching doors. for secret no doors. No secret doors. <laughs> I've had this strange feeling like I should be searching for secret doors. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> but there were no secret doors to be had. Nope. Okay, well, I guess that was a freebie. Okay. <laughs> Bard. Hey, Pirate. it's an uncommon feat. It happens. Pirate orc. <laughs> Very uncommon. Piratey orc bard man guy. Um, 
Hold on, it's been trying to grab my. We're all a little finagled here today. There we go. Two. Oh no, we're getting free free dice. Man, I keep forgetting about that. Yeah, me too. just yeah, moving towards the staircase. <laughs> Wait a minute. There's there's all this area up here. All all this oh. There's at least one well, room up there. This this pirate has to has to bounce in fifteen minutes. Oh, okay. Unfortunately. I'm not even sure but how much movement you had. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 7, 12. There we go. Yeah, you're right. You're right. We're we're just about at the end. This is this is a pretty good evening. I thank you all for your participation. Yeah, it was fun today. Yeah. It's the app. It's serviceable. You kind of got to know what you're doing. It's true. All right. Ilviler. All right. Yeah, I guess I'll just move as far as I can go. All right. Barbecue Barian. Should I be checking out the room that we didn't check out? Um, if you'd like to, it's up to you. Could be more treasure, could be more fight, as PSK would say. Treasure and fight is what you go for. <laughs> if you want to yes, run up there, I'll tag along. Sure. I got a sleep spell left. Probably want yeah. me to roll movement dice for that, right? Why would you do that? There's no monsters. Oh, I guess. Okay. Yeah. I mean, could. If you think you're going to get a 20 or something, then I'll know you're cheating. <laughs> it's like D6s, man. What are you doing? Open the door. Yep. Yeah, word. Ooh. And there, there's eight. There's eight chaos warriors. They're there. <laughs> Eighty chaos warriors. You gotta place a special order with Games Workshop to get a a full army. They come in just like. Five or six at a time. <laughs> okay, so you revealed an orc and a femur. I'm just going to stay there. I can't even attack. Laugh. By the time I get there, they'll be dead. Shit. <laughs> All right, Jade, sir. Oh, All right, let me search for treasure. Okay. Dwarf. Searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure it's, uh, card. Type Tavile treasure playing, on your uh, character Aldithor, sheet. The apathetic wizard. <laughs> it's a wandering monster. <laughs> Zargon's turn. <laughs> yourself, right. dwarf. Roll your defend dice. Uh, I'm halfway between you. I don't know which way to go now. And <laughs> and Jace is playing Hero's Beldorf, turn. the bad luck uh. dwarf. He got. He's in the pit, so he's weakened. But he still rolled two skulls. <laughs> so he spawned out of the pit. That's funny. Yep. He could have spawned on the other side. Yep. You were. I don't understand the AI. Pit. You were standing on him. That's why he's pit. <laughs> <laughs> like I thought that was. Oh, that's the entrance to their cave. I get it. Yeah. All right. <laughs> he, All right. He so what are you getting for? All right, what'd you get? I asked how many he hit me with. Oh, he hit you with two. You you have your full defense. He just didn't have his full attack. Okay. I got two shields. Okay. Cha-ching! All right, pirate. All right. Um, right. I'm rolling now, right? Yep. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Got seven. I guess I'm I'm still heading for the stairs. Sorry guys. Slash not sorry. You know that first sorry, room you hasn't, got, hasn't You got been songs to sing. Thanks. You gotta get to the tavern and start singing about Drinks. how we killed Yulag. <laughs> yeah. Drinks to be drunk. One Someone's more got a few days and wonder why we didn't come back. 
One more uh, search roll time's sake, or are you heading out? Uh, no, do a, yeah, do a search. Right. Do a search for some uh, treasure. Treasure hunter. Bye. Searches the area what if for it's another treasure. Monster? Draw a treasure. Card. I guess I'll Correct just face palm and your kill the wandering sheet. monster. It is. <laughs> are you kidding? You are kidding me, right? I'm not That's kidding. Two in a row. I'm not. Oh kidding. my god! Really well, you guys were getting so many good cards. It's like, hmm. There's six wandering monster <laughs> cards in the deck. At some Did point, you go back every time. Did you shuffle, Curtin? Good cards Did don't you? come out. No. Or don't go back. See, this is this is how I play. Other people have different ways of playing. Some people shuffle after every single search, which I guess technically you should. In one part of the manual, they don't tell you that. In the other part, they do tell you that. So that's how I've always played, but yeah. Eh, well. I guess it's, it's what I get for trying to pirate my way out of the party early. <laughs> Zargon's turn. Defend <laughs> yourself, oh. mud. Roll your defend dice. All right. That's what we get for splitting the party. And then you took one hit, so down to three. Split the party. Doom and wrath await. Wizard. And I rolled a seven, so... Take me in the direction of the barbarian, please. Alright, you're in range to hit him with a spell, but I'm not sure he... Well? Well, let's cast Veil of Mist on him. Then he can go through monsters if he needs to. <laughs> okay. As you wish. That way, if the orc blocks the door, he can walk through the orc and kill the uh, Fimmer. Yeah, true. The barbarians may now pass through monsters! Alright, Zargon's turn. Zargon's turn! <laughs> Why didn't he come out of the pit? Throw your defend dice! What a noob! <laughs> Alright, one, one hit. Oh. One shield. <laughs> so it's got to <laughs> for some durst. <laughs> Thanks, Lotion Master. That me. <laughs> All right. You got one hit. Jacer. Yeah, I got one shield. Ching. I, I rolled one of each. <laughs> <laughs> Misses. Ooh, monster rolled three black shields. Now it's a whiff, but that's a villainous feat. So I'm gonna say, um, even though the monster missed with his sword, he grabs the barbarian by the shoulder and just like headbutts him like super hard. <laughs> oh. And it like caves in your helmet and does one body point of damage. Nice. Let's get down to three. Defend <laughs> yourself, bud. Roll your defense. I'm just catching dice. up here on the screen. All right, pirate, roll for defense. You get two hits. I'll roll for you. Ooh, two hits. Down to one. Now you do have healing left. Two different healing abilities. So never fear. But Heroes you could always turn. duck out of the quest if you needed to. Okay. So um, what happened here? That spell should still be active, shouldn't it? Why would it wear off? Uh, yeah, for some reason they seem like they wear off. Even though it says to the hero's next movement or next attack. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Okay. Hmm. Well, I don't know if you're going to use it or not, but uh, let's see. What would it be? It would be Dust of Disappearance. Okay. All right. What do you got, Sir Death? Oh, for movement? Yeah. That is 10 for movement. Five and a five. 
So yeah, I'll just come up behind the abomination there, or Femir, whichever you like. And I'll attack him with my three dice. That is two shields and a skull. Okay. No defense. Abdomen and back. Backstab. All right, Jaser. All right, I'm going to attack. And two skulls. Defends with one less, so he only defends with one. Wow. Oh, he's, so he's, he's toast. Toasty. Well, at least he's already in a pit. He's already buried. <laughs> already buried. The orc has been defeated. I'll use an uncommon feat to kick some dirt on him. <laughs> and I failed. Oh. Hold on here. I went to kick some dirt on him. I failed. I kicked some tile in on him. Rest. <laughs> you stubbed your toe. You stubbed your toe. I just spent the rest of my turn hopping on one foot. <laughs> Half I'll roll one for combat that. die for movement, or one uh, red die for movement instead of two. <laughs> All right, move me uh, three spaces. For my stub toe. <laughs> Take Bad luck to work. Again. All right, pirate. Yeah, man. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's get rid of this monster so we can get up those stairs. All right. Oh, two black shields missed. Uh, now, I attack for attrition. <laughs> okay, how is this going to work? Remember like what I did with the barbarian? Yeah, you're going to have to rem remind me. So... Do I attack equal to the amount of body points I have? Ooh, okay. You so, if I'm, a if I'm attacking with two die, right... Then if I fail, or no, if I'm attacking using an uncommon feat, if I fail, I take one body point. If I succeed, I can roll for another attack. Okay, so I'm rolling one combat die for you? Correct. All right. I had to rethink about that because I think we did something funky with the Barbarian because I was yeah, attacking did. with like extra strength. So we had to attack equal yeah. to the number of dice I had or something like that. Yeah. It, it kind of works because you had a bunch of body points. Okay, so you yeah. you have one body point and you rolled a skull. So you succeeded? Yeah, so I'm able to do another attack. Alright. Alright, so you got one skull. And he'll defend. Ching! So he blocked it? Yep. That mean? Here's the thing that sucks, is I still take a body point. And they're dead. Oof. But you did have the uh, potion 1d6. Go ahead, roll your 1d6. Okay. Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> it put the d20 I, away. I got... I got, I got six. I got six. All right. You got the special way to die in the magnet. All, all, it's all on the wrist. Okay, so you, uh, you're back at full health. Five. Okay. Okay. Interesting. All right. And I'm all, I'm all set. I, I'm sorry. I had to remember that on the fly, and I, I remember that like if I'm asking for an extra attack, either way, I'm taking damage. It was so oh. it was so complex. I was like, "Wow, we really getting into I this." I think it was for every for whatever you rolled, the hits counted for hits, and anything that you missed counted as a as you getting losing a body point or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I think this works a little bit simply. So like, it's just either way you take yeah. damage. So, mm -hmm. all right, 
are you but the 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 big money question is are you going to use your last bit of movement to like flee down the stairs yes i'm out but you're at full health well now i only Uh, have three minutes left you're gonna leave this this guy (laughs) blocking the stairway for us ah fine i'll stick around Oh, you talked me into it. <laughs> oh, look <at> this guy. <laughs> All right, wizard. We got to get ready for the rant cast, but we're almost done. Okay, wizard. Ilviler. I rolled two. <laughs> Does that give me uh, enough? Uh... Mm. Like, do I have line of sight there? No, from there? No, you don't. But if you want to <laughs> you try roll to for x-ray vision. Uncommon feet to try to throw yourself forward. Sure. Or... All right. Let's, let's try that. One combat die. Ugh. Weight shield. All right. You tripped and fell. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. He tripped and he fell, but he's closer. Can he see the orc? <laughs> he fell, like, straight down. He didn't... <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's uncommon feet Friday. No, it's not. <laughs> yeah. All right. No, monster. it's just stepping on your own feet. Monsters. Yeah. Zargon's <laughs> turn. Here comes the orc. <laughs> Misses. Ooh, he missed, but he got a uh, villainous feet. Okay. So um, the orc. Um, whips the shoelaces out of your boots that were tied together and he like starts to like choke you with it and so you uh you're dead die yep did you did you die you killed him off i killed him that's but that's that's a horrible way to go but yeah. you do have the uh heal body from earth heal body yeah so i'm forcing and you water of healing oh, oh right. yeah water heal body healing. yeah Oh, you wanted to right. the other one? Yeah, it doesn't matter which one. Okay, heal body, so you're back to four. All right. Defend yourself, barbarian. Roll your defend dice. Not warbly attack. Okay, so barbarian, two hits. Shield. Bard. Roll Sorry. your defend dice. The roaring was so loud. What did you say? I only rolled one shield. Okay. So I'm down to one health. Really? I had you at three. Oh, never mind. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Uh, and pirate, you just have two hits. So let's take your defense. Cha-ching! Blocked them both. Oh, All right. Do be careful. <laughs> do be careful. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, Sir Death. Hopefully, I can kill this thing this turn. Let's see. Two skulls and a shield. All right. Ching, and then one hit. Got him. Nice. The abomination has been defeated. Got him. All right, Jacer. Four. Still with the sub toe, or you really rolled four? No, I really, I rolled. Well, I rolled doubles. Uh, here, let me uncommon feet that the doubles give me double. <laughs> Ah, oh, damn it! No, <laughs> white shield. <laughs> so fell, four <laughs> fell straight down. Uh, let, uh, let me search. Uh, uh, for secret doors. I think I already did treasure. Dwarf searches for Clean. secret Nothing. doors. No right, secret good. doors found. All right, pirate. All right, let's uh, let's attack again. Two skulls. Ching. Got him. Yeah, I like it when a plan comes together. The orc 
has died. Uh, there you go. And you're only two minutes late. Random um, Sorry, I put the notification up. We're, we're all good. All right. Um, all right, so... What I'm going to do... I can move into that staircase, right? Yep. Yes. Okay. I'm going to do that. And... Um, Escape are we still... Are we still doing uh, prep today, or do you want to do that tomorrow, Kurgan? Um, let's prep. It won't take long. Okay. We, we well, I'm up. not gonna stop. Yeah, <laughs> I'll just be, I'll just be in the, in the stream okay. if you uh, I, I want to let me know. I won't be long unless these guys really do something crazy. But I'll take, take your time. I just didn't want to. I I know that I hop in and hop out, and I, I want to thank everybody for for allowing me to to do that and. Uh, Elvira, always a pleasure. Jacer, thanks for, uh, you know, letting me hop in. Kurgan. And uh, Sir Death, it's a pleasure. To yeah, thank you very much. Come in, but, everybody. Yeah, I'm going to start. I'm playing Gauntlet, so, I mean, I don't know how long everybody else is staying up or if they own Gauntlet, but Hero Quest always gets me in a Gauntlet mood, so <laughs> I'll be, uh, I'll be playing that. So um, have a good night, everybody, and I'll catch you later. Everybody check cool. out The Mike. Strange Bus. See you. Yep, have a good one. He's escaped the dungeon. Alright. Wizard. Got an orc in your face. Yep. I uh, rolled a five. Get me as far away from that thing as possible. And then while I'm running, I will cast Sleep behind my shoulder. Nice. <laughs> I like this guy. Ah, he's asleep. The orc has fallen asleep. Nice. Paralyzed. Okay. Zargon. Zargon's turn. Failed. It's still asleep. Hero's turn. Mm. All right. Barbarian. I'll maybe just search for treasure here. Even if the guy wakes up, I should be able to kill him. Barbarian searches the area for treasure. Weapons rack is well stocked and from its battered appearance, clearly well used. You find a staff weapon, which allows you to attack diagonally with one attack die. Add the staff to your character sheet. Hmm. Eh. You know what? Since you've already got a staff, let's just say that you uh, chuck that staff back in there and you, you look again and you find a spear. Cool. <laughs> so a spear is actually a two attack diagonal weapon. And it can be thrown, but it's lost once it's thrown. I guess it breaks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. All and right. I got five on movement, but I can only move, what, three because the monster's there? Well... I've always and over said that, his sleeping body. I've always said that you can pass through a sleeping monster if he's not there. But what do you think? It's whatever you want. You would have to do another artifact on me, yeah. right? Or like another scroll. Yeah. Just do work around. I like the fact that they left that in there so that you could do that kind of stuff. Like mm -hmm. you can you can finagle a lot of house rules that way. Okay, dust of disappearance. There we go. Chaser. Oh, there's still a corridor that hasn't been explored. Wow, I'm sure there's not much anything there. <laughs> Seven. Not much anything. I'm not making sense. Sorry, I just assumed. Is that the right direction you wanted to go? Yeah, uh, yeah, towards the stairs. All right. Wizard. Elviler. Running for five. Right. See if he wakes up. Zargon's turn. 
Spell break is successful. Ooh, he's awake. He's not happy. <laughs> yeah, there's a barbarian between him and me. He completely missed. He's still groggy. <laughs> Hero's turn. All right. You're up, Sir Death. Well, may as well attack him. That is two skulls. So now he's on equal footing. Fighting chance. Ching! But it wasn't enough. And he's dead. Nice. The orc has died. And then because he's dead, are you just giving me all 12 movement? Sure. Yeah, just move me close to the stairs then. I think the wizard has the speed potion too. So really needed yep. to get out of there, he could. That's true. Double your movement. Or, well, I guess double the dice you roll for movement. Well, which in this case, it would just be, yeah, 24. It's not a matter yeah, but I don't think he needs it now. Yeah. yeah, I'll save it. Yeah. That's true, during a free movement period. Okay. Chaser. Uh, 12 towards the door. Or, uh... Did I search this room for treasure? Yeah. Alright, then yeah, move me 12. Okay. Wizard. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna about to roll, but just move me towards the exit. Rolling's fun, but oh, you got enough. You want to exit the quest? Yes, please. <laughs> Alrighty. Off to the tavern or wherever. The Museum of Fine Arts. On the way to the tavern. Barbarian. Same thing for me. Alright, easy. So it's the lure of more loot. And Jay, sir, I presume you're going for the same deal? Yeah, I just want to search that stair room for treasure. But I want to be next to the stairs if I can. As close to the stairs as possible when I do it. Dwarf searches the area for treasure. Draw a treasure card. Track Gem. treasure on your character sheet. Gem, 35 right. gold coins. Get that last bit of loot. All right. Man after my own cool. heart. I'm buying a shield. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And since you're the only one, off you go now. Congratulations, everybody. That's quest. You know. have done well, brave heroes. Having defeated Ulag and made your exit from this, from his lair, you have succeeded in your quest. Quest complete. Prince Magnus rewards you for bringing swift justice upon the warlord. You receive 180 gold coins, to be divided equally among the surviving heroes. Excellent. 180 for the group. All right. Prepare for future quests, my friends. Excellent. Okay, well, thank you, everybody. It was a great night. Appreciate um, you playing. Thanks for doing the collab, uh, Sir Death. Yeah, you're very welcome. This was quite fun. Yeah, everybody be sure and check out his YouTube channel, as if you didn't already know. <laughs> but <laughs> definitely check out his stuff. Uh, I'm sure there's going to be a lot more things as Gen Con rolls forward in two days. You'll be making videos, Amalgamash, myself, Always Bored and Every Boring, everybody else that has any tangential in interest in HeroQuest as they find out more and more things. So should be cool. All right. Yeah, I'll have to get cracking on the yeah. video for the news that came out like four days ago. Oh, yeah. I'll check it out. 
I'll be right. curious to see it. And everybody check out Elviler.com. And Jacer, I always forget. Do you have something or are you just you're just a cool guy? Uh, I have like YouTube videos, but they're all over the place and random. Oh, like the last shoot. one was the fire pit. Yeah, what's, what's the name of have, what's the name of that channel? Uh, it's uh, uh, Warbuilder J22. Warbuilder and it's basically J22. J22. Okay, correct and me if I'm wrong. It's basically just painting terrain and Hero Quest and you... Battle Masters and oh. a little bit of uh, Warhammer. Yes. Did you do the thing where you combined Hero Quest and Battle Masters together to simulate the fight after uh, Keller's Keep? The one after Keller's Keep, and I did the Battle of Blackfire Pass after the first 14 quests in the main thing. That so yeah, the that whole was thing ambitious. with the emperor. Yeah, that was because it was every model I think I had wow. out at the time. I want to say I had it on. Like I watched it for a while, and then I had it on in the background. But it's like, wow, it's still going. It's like, dang. <laughs> so yeah, it cool, cool. it was ten rounds, and there's or ten turns or five rounds or whatever. So it's like fifty turns each side. So you yeah, need, it does well, take a while. You really what you need is like a team of like kids. Like everybody, like job, like okay, you got you guys moved these these units, and like you know you got flags, and you're like directing, yeah, but that's pretty awesome, yeah. So definitely check that out. It's very unique. It's cool. Um, all right. Anybody else? Thank Let's you see. Guys. Yep. Thanks. Thanks everybody in the chat. Everybody have a great night, and uh, see you on the rant cast tomorrow. All right. Good game. Good game. Hey. Right. Thanks. Night.